Hello, 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 my dear watchers. Today we are going to begin something quite wonderful, something quite magical, something just amazing. Today we're going to be playing. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. The Pokemon Mystery Dungeon series began with two games at the beginning, I believe, of the DS's life cycle. So what they decided to do was make one of them Pokemon Red Rescue Team and make it for the Game Boy Advance. And then they made Pokemon Blue Rescue Team for the DS. This is the first, funnily enough, I think actually technically, my first uh, Mystery Dungeon game was Red Rescue Team, but I finished that playthrough on, well, that playthrough, I made a new playthrough on a Blue Rescue Team. Because, and I just fell in love with the series. I then went on to play Explorers of Sky, loved that too. But one thing that I have, uh, haven't done is, besides, uh, having not played the other games in the series, both of the three odd WiiWare games, which don't really interest me, and then the 3DS... Uh, Gates to Infinity, and the 3DS Super Mystery Dungeon. I haven't played them, so they're on the list. Well, I've played a bit of Super Mystery Dungeon, up to a point, but I forget a lot of it. There are certain things that, like, out-of-context spoilers, I think, that I got for some of them, so I don't know. But that'll be for those games. For this one... We're gonna go where it all began, technically. Pokemon Blue Rescue Team. And we're gonna see... How it goes. Because it's been years since I played this game. And one thing that I want to do, because I actually cut myself off on that, is actually play through all of the post-game. Because I only beat the... the main story for both this and Explorers of Sky, what I want to do is do as much as possible. Maybe not 100% completion of get all the Pokemon recruits, because I think that's crazy. But I want to see how much I can do. So without further ado, first I'm going to make a safe state. Because I don't trust technology. And this is just the easiest way to record this. I actually own a cart of this, and I own it on the Wii U, because I was like, oh, it's on the Virtual Console, I'll use the Virtual Console. It's kind of a pain to set up the Virtual Console to work properly, blah blah blah. So I think it's just easier, and just visually better to do it this way. And hopefully... DS Moomy just doesn't freak out this hunk of junk of an emulator. But without further ado, let us begin our game of Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. Welcome! This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. But before I can let you through, I have several questions for you. I want you to answer them sincerely. Are you ready? Okay. Let the interview begin! And one thing that I'm going to do is I'm specifically going to go for a specific Pokemon to recreate my old team. Which definitely means gaming the quiz, but hey. Overall, I still like the quiz, but I'm I'm the gamer gamer. You win the lottery. What do you do with the money? I shall save it. Do you get the feeling that you've slowed down lately? Wow, thank you for hitting me in my... my... my soul. I don't think I've slowed down. I'm, if anything, I've sped up on certain things. But I'll say yes for reasons. 
your country's leader, is in front of you, how do you speak to them? Or her? I'm getting none of the personality things that I need for the Pokemon I want. I speak calmly. Do you like to fight? I've never been in a fight, so I don't know. I'm just getting none of the th personality things that I need. But I shall say yes for points. To see if I can eke out what I need. It's the summer festival. Do you like carnivals? Sure. It's the weekend, but no one will play with you. <laughs> well, that's relatable. Ladies and gentlemen, the weekend of pain. <laughs> Huddle in a corner. I guess I'll go on a trip. There's an alien invasion. What will you do? I guess I shall run. You broke a rotten egg in your room. Who would ever do that? Why would you have a rotten egg in your room? Why would you do that? <laughs> For points. Take a sniff first. I don't think that'll work, but let's see. Nope. We must restart, because we did not get what we require. And that's why I have a restart. Mainly because it's a little bit hard to reset the whole thing. But let's answer them sincerely. Me just gaming the entire thing to get the Pokemon I want. And I'm gonna get the Pokemon I want! It's not even like... <laughs> it's not even like a, a meta game thing. I just want the Pokemon that I want, man. Can you focus on something you like? Like, I shall do no for points. Do you laugh a lot? Actually, I'd say yes. Your friend is being bullied. What do you do? I guess I shall face up to the bully. Do you hate to be the last person to leave the class at the end of the school day? No. Do you fall asleep without noticing? I say no, which is actually true. Can you sincerely thank someone when you feel grateful? Let's see. I will say no. Doop. Somebody calls you weird, but funny. How does that make you feel? Well, I guess it makes... <laughs> actually, honestly, being weird but funny, it's still positive. Let's see if I got all the points that I require. The brave type! Ah, that's not what I wanted at all. I'm farming for points! This is the world for Pokemon. Here's an arbitrary quiz that doesn't really function because it doesn't give you a full thing. I guess I shall say I love them. Fall asleep without noticing? No. It's a weekend, but no one will play if you. Go on a trip. A human extends... Toilet. Toilet! Oh, this is a Zelda reference, I would say. I guess I shall shake the hand. Can you focus on something you like? No. Have you ever made Pitfall Trap? I guess I shall say yes. You found a treasure chest. Hmm. 
I guess I shall open it right away. Do you like to imagine things for your own amusement? Oh, yeah, actually. It goes along with the points, and it's true. I think daydream all the day. The day away. God dang it. It's not giving me all the choices that I require. This is the portal that <laughs> you seem to be. This is the portal that leads to the world of Pokemon. You've been here quite a while. Sleep without. And can you fall asleep without noticing? No. Do you like pranks? Do you like jazz? <laughs> What's the deal with airplane food? No. Do you feel lonesome when you are alone? What else would you feel when you are alone? Can you focus on something you like? Just trying to farm points. Get what I require. Do you often yawn? It depends. Sometimes I yawn the day away. Other times I don't yawn at all. Grab any digit on your left hand with your right hand. Which finger did you grab? I didn't do that because I'm too busy. Also, this is a terrible way of determining personality. I guess if you grab that one, you're this personality type. And of course, none of them are the personality type that I need. You're offered a choice between two gifts. What do you choose? Oh no. It's Yakuza Zero all over again. Do you think you are cool? Honestly, no, but it depends what the points say. I didn't, I, I know I didn't. I know I didn't get the personality type for the Pokemon I want. I just want a single Pokemon. It also doesn't help that this Pokemon it can only be gotten on one of the gender branches. <laughs> this... Well, hey, it's this one again. It's worthless to me. I guess I'll go with Middle Finger, which gives the Jolly personality type. Why? Ho oh, ho, oh, you jokester. You like to... <laughs> flip people off. How quickly do you respond to an email? Give me my personality time! Too much trouble. Do you laugh a lot? Yes. Do you feel lonesome when you are alone? I'm gonna say yes just for points. Gotta farm them points. No. Can you sincerely thank someone? Well, that definitely didn't. The docile type. Nope. It's like every, like, nyeh. Give me questions that I require. It would be one thing if it was like an even distribution, but it isn't. It is a lie. You come across a treasure chest. What do you do? I murder the pirates. I take the treasure for myself. I bathe in their bloody guts and I laugh. And I laugh. And I laugh. Are there many things you like to do? I don't know what well, the chart says. I'm going to say... Eh, sure. Are you a cheerful personality? Sure, that's what the chart says. It is a pleasant day outside. Hey, how do you feel? Oh, snore. Rotten egg. Grab a digit. Do you sometimes run out of things all of a sudden? 
Actually, sometimes when my brain is like, I want to do things. And then my brain is also at the same time, no. There's an alien invasion, what will you do? Depends on what the chart says. It should not take this long. I shall run. God dang it. God dang it. Give me the questions that I require so I can harvest the Pokemon I want to be. That's not how you play this game. I want to do it. It's not even for a metagaming point of like, oh, yes, this team is the greatest and gives me the greatest ability of doing things. Blah. I just want the Pokemon that I want. A delinquent is hassling a girl on a busy street. What will you do? Become Kiryu from Yakuza and smack him up. Let's see. I shall call the police. <laughs> is that a weed? I'm calling the police! I just want one question. Give me what I require. Please. Can you go into a haunted house? Uh, it really depends, like, time of day, if other people are there. I'm gonna say, oh, uh, no. Do you often yawn? I shall say no. What's when the going gets tough? Do you get going? Not really. I really just fall through the floor and I die. Are you a cheerful personality? I don't think I'm getting it again. God damn it! Why is it this, like, super hyper-rare specific situation? Like, once again, it would be one thing if it asked you all the questions. But it doesn't. Normally, it's like... Not that bad if you're just playing the game as a normal person, but I'm not a normal person. I am not a normal person, I just want... I just want my one Pokemon, and once again, not even for meta reasons, or like... A friend brought over something you'd forgotten. How do you thank your friend? <laughs> Say thanks with a joke. You tend to laugh a lot. I don't know. Depends on what the chart says. I think I'm... Do you occasionally consider yourself dull and overly cautious? Actually, yes, but it depends on what the, the chart says. I shall say no, though. Your friend fails to show up. Yeah, that, that happens. And it fails to show up at a promised time. <laughs> They're a monster but I shall wait patiently. Ah, goddammit. <laughs> Once again, it's like, ooh, five. They couldn't even give me one. Couldn't even give me the one that I want. <laughs> Do you get the feeling that you've slowed down lately? Uh, once again, no. I've actually sped up on my art. Are you a boy or a girl? You're not... <laughs> You're not gonna give it to me. I got it! Yay! No more! I don't have to worry anymore! I gamed the system! That's the one downside in the- like, on the one side, I, uh, like, really do like the quiz. I just like the concept of it. But at the same time, sometimes you just want that Pokémon that you want to be. 
let me choose my Pokemon. That's why I liked Super Mystery Dungeon, because it brought back the quiz, but at the same time it's just like, oh, is that not what you are? Well, you pick for yourself. But anyways, you appear to be the naive type. You are highly curious and you love rare things. Your cheerful and carefree attitude should make things fun for the people around you. But you do have one flaw. You can be childish. You can never sit still. You're always on the move. You can also be selfish, so you should watch yourself. A naive person like you should be the Pokemon Eevee. And this is the final step. Who would you like to have as your partner? Choose the Pokemon you want as your partner from this group. I shall choose my old friend, Trico. Come forth once more, my man, my dude, my partner in crime, my friend, Shane the Trico. Ha. Ah. I thought that was end, not delete. I'm a fool. My brain. My brain! Is the name Shane okay? Yes, it is. Okay, we're all set. Let's get you into the world of Pokemon. Go for it! Where am I? Am I dreaming this? I feel a pleasant breeze. I hear a voice from somewhere. I wonder who it is. Excuse me. Please wake up. Come on, wake up. You're finally awake. Great. What? Where is this? You were passed out here. I'm glad to see you awake. I'm Shane, glad to meet you. And you are? I've never seen you around before. Huh? You're a human? Well, you look like a normal Eevee in every way. How would you even not notice? It, it's true. I've turned into an Eevee. But why? I don't remember anything. Um, you're kind of weird. Your name? What's your name? My name? That's right, my name is... Of course. The only way. The only name I know. I am Neon. Oh, Neon's your name? Well, it's a funny name. I've been insulted by the first face I've seen in this world. Somebody, please help me! Huh? I hear shouts from over there. What's wrong? It's horrible! My Caterpie fell into a cavern! My poor baby! What? A huge fissure opened in the ground and my Caterpie fell in. He's too young to crawl out by himself. When I went to get my baby, Pokemon suddenly attacked me. Huh? You were attacked? By other Pokemon? They must be enraged by the fissure and out of control. That's what I think. I'm not strong enough to fend, out, fend off those wild Pokemon. What will become of my baby? Oh, what am I to do? Oh dear, oh dear. This sounds bad. We have to go help! Tiny Woods. Head for the destination while attacking foes with A. Try not to let a partner faint. Come to me, fool. Haha! <laughs> I still got it. Pokey is the money in this world. Collect and save it to buy useful items. I'm not gonna move on yet, I have things to destroy. Well, let's see. Throw, moves, items, team, menu. I wonder. Ground? There is nothing at Neon's feet. I don't think I can uh, mess with things yet. Oh, I got smacked. Can I use moves? I know Tail Whip, Tackle, Ah, he knows Leer and Pound. I just wanted to see. I'll have to do more information looking. Well, since this is the first world... Let's see, is there a... Ooh! I wonder what that is. I wonder. 
I don't even know what that is. I guess it's just like, hey, you're looking that way. Oh, it's so you can orient yourself without actually moving. You can move diagonally. It's just a little wonky. Let's see. Ah, info. Lowers the target's defense by one level. Helping hand. Info. Boosts the attack and special attack of team members in the same room by one level. And the leer, I know it should be. Yep, defense by one level, and pound should just be another tackle. Inflict damage, yep. Come along, Shane. We have evils to slaughter. There's a Wurmple. Get back here, Wurmple. Beat him up, Shane. Oh, you can't attack from there, can you? Can't attack from corners. Got it. Well, put that out of the way. There, the only items were in this room. Stairs leading to the next floor. If you are on the final floor, you will escape the dungeon. Tiny Woods, Basement 2. Foes won't move until you do. Open the menu with B and think before you act. Ah, uh, this brings back so many memories. So many memories. I'm gonna tackle you. Yeah, in this game, the primary way of dealing with enemies is just the normal A attack. In future games, I think they encourage you to use moves more, but it's been forever since I dabbled with them, so I don't really know. In this game, it is all about smacking them and letting them smack you back. Come to me, and I'll go ahead and uh, tackle you. Because it's the- Oh, crap! I got- I, I missed! But can you blame me? I've been at Eevee for like five minutes! And I've already been conscripted into the war. I'll just tackle you. Neon grew to level six. Yay, I leveled up. And went up by three, attack went up by two, defense up by two, special attack went by two, special defense up by two. And more pokey. But that's not everything. We must adventure onwards. Ever onwards. Funnily enough, I've never actually played other mystery, uh, yeah, mystery dungeon games. This is my first and only, well, this other ones. The Pokemon mystery dungeon as a whole is my one and only. Ah, Shane leveled up. Learned Observe. I did it! Level up! HP went up by three, attack by two, defense by two, special attack by two, special defense by two. Lure them in, and then murder. But yeah, I've never played other uh, mystery dungeon games like Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon and the like. I've only ever done this one. The Mr. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon games. The team regains HP as it moves. Hold B, then press A to recover quickly. Oh. Ah. And then when I did... Uh, I was just trying to show off, and life got in the way. Life came at me fast. Tackle attack. Neon, use tackle. But yeah. If you press B, you move and go super fast. Orenberry. An Orenberry restores HP. Open the menu with B and select it under items. I shall not. Thank you very much, because I don't need it. Oh, crap. Uh, I'm going to... See, burp, burp. Come to me, smack. Yay. Hmm. Items, Orenberry. Uh, because I don't have a bag. I shall throw this at, uh... Oh, there we go, that works. I was gonna throw the berry at Shane so that he would pick it up. Either that would hit him for massive damage, which would be hilarious. Quit hitting me with berries! I'm... I know I'm a grass type, but that doesn't mean I like to be pelted with berries! 
Yeah, if anything, I've kind of gimped myself with my team choice because... Whoop! Ah, crap. Yeah, <laughs> you really have to handhold your AI allies a bit, unless, team. Let's talk. I'll do my best. Summary. No status. Overgrow. Boost the power of grass-type moves when HP is low. Well, that won't be all that great. Friend area. Overgrown forest. Size. One. <laughs> Check IQ. Item catcher. Huh. IQ skills. Info. The Pokemon will focus on traveling. It will use moves and items left off so often. Exclusive move user. Although I can order him to use moves, which helps, but... Boo. Let us move on. Funnily enough... Pokemon Mystery Dungeon is part of the reason why I kind of want to look into other mystery... Well, yeah, other, like, Mystery Dungeon games. Like, like Chocobo's Mystery Dungeon. I just like the feeling of exploring. But it would... Really, the thing that gets me is the story and the feeling, because come on. It's playing a Pokemon game, and you are the Pokemon. That is the wondrous part. Hey there, Caterpie. He's the final boss! Where? Mommy, where are you? <laughs> We came to rescue you. Huh? Your mom's waiting. Let's get you out. Okay. My baby's safe. I'm sorry. I don't know how I could ever thank you properly. Oh, that's okay. It has been dangerous lately with sudden quakes and fissures like that one. It was great to find your little boy unharmed. Please, may I have your names at least? I'm Shane, and this is Neon. Cool. <laughs> He's, uh, staring at me adoringly. The sparkly eyes, it's a little embarrassing. But this doesn't feel bad, either. It's like I'm a hero. Helping Pokemon in trouble might be a good experience. Thank you, Jane and Neon. I know it isn't really enough, but this is a token of our thanks. Please accept it. The promised Orenberry. And a Pekka Berry. And a Rost Berry. We can't carry all these berries. It's like that one meme picture. I can't carry all these berries. Thank you so much. Goodbye. Thank you for helping. You're very tough. I wish you were surprised, uh, impressed. So, what are you gonna do? Do you have any plans? <laughs> Listen, Neon, if you don't have a place to stay, you should come with me. Well, this is the place. It's a berry house! Wow, I can't explain, but I'm happy. I'm a human being, but I like this place. I feel weirdly happy. It, it's my natural habitat. It overrides all senses but joy. It might be an instinct thing for Pokemon. Maybe this is what it feels like to want to wag your tail. It doesn't matter. I'm happy. Maybe I feel that way because I'm Eevee. <laughs> Neon, you're impressed, aren't you? I thought so. I thought this would make a good place for you to live, Neon. I was sure you would like it. This is your mailbox. They deliver mail from Pokemon here. You know, just like the Fissure Caterpie fell into. For some reason, there have been many natural disasters lately. Because of those disasters, many Pokemon are suffering. I want to help Pokemon in these tough times. I want to help change things so all Pokemon can live in peace. So, uh, well, I liked how you handled yourself when you rescued Caterpie. Would you like to join me on a rescue team? Neon, with you, I think we could even become the world's best rescue team. How about it? I have no idea what happens if you refuse, but I will not hurt my new friend. Form a rescue team! Perfect! That's it, then. We're partners in our rescue team from now on, Neon. Glad to have you on board. The team name. Well, I don't have one yet. So 
So, Neon, what do you think we would make a good name for us? Huh. Pokemon Team. No, no. An old name from a long time ago. A team name that shines ever onward. Team... Shining. And hopefully it's the correct pr spelling and not shinning. Team Shining. Shining. I like it. It's a good name. It's perfect for us. Rescue Team Shining. Let's do a good starting tomorrow. Let's do good starting tomorrow. Ha ha! Pose! And that is how Neon and Shane began their careers together as a rescue team. This is just hitting me so hard in all my feels. I love it. I love Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. And even though, like, uh, Rescue Team DX does look decent, I just love the pixel art style. I'll, then again, I'll, it'll really depend, because if I ever get further along in my Poke Marathon mania, and if I ever actually get to Rescue Team DX, I'll be able to judge it properly and see how it is in motion, and not just from the scant few things that I saw. But let us see. The next morning... I even have complimentary apples and water. I'm still the same. The way I look, I'm still Eevee. But why would I be transformed into a Pokemon? Uh, I don't understand this at all. I feel groggy and sleepy. Not feeling well. I need more sleep. Yeah, well, that's normal. Apples. Water. But I want to... Now I only want to sleep. I'll rest in bed. I find it funny that this is kind of the tutorial. We woke you up just so that you can <laughs> go back to sleep. I would like to save my adventure. Save complete. Oof. I'm feeling refreshed. I still look like a Pokemon, but... Oh, that's right. That Pokemon. I think it was Shane. We made a promise to form a rescue team together. I wonder what Shane is doing. I should go out. The guy gives you a house. Forget his name. Huh? Oh no! <laughs> Sorry. I was so excited I came out here at dawn to wait for you. I must have snoozed off. Anyway, today marks the start of our rescue team. Let's always do our best. But anyway, we don't have any job offers yet. <laughs> we did just start, you know. Oh yeah, maybe there's something in the mailbox. You didn't check the mail? Shane, check the mailbox. A rescue team starter set. I knew it'd be there. It's the rescue team starter set. They always give you one if you start a rescue team. Shane opened the rescue team starter set. There was a rescue team badge inside. There was a toolbox inside. There was also an issue of Pokemon news inside. Yes! There are some good things in here. First off, the rescue team badge. It shows that we're a rescue team. This is a toolbox. Use it for carrying items you find in dungeons. Let's put the stuff Butterfree gave us in here for now. Items are very useful, so let's use them on our adventures. And finally, a copy of the Pokemon News. It's useful for rescue teams. I'll put the Pokemon News in the mailbox. You should read it later on. Anything else? Is there any other mail? Maybe not? Shane checked the mailbox, but the mailbox was empty. And I checked my messages, but there were no any messages. Okay, so there isn't any mail for us after all. If there were any rescue jobs, we'd be getting mail, but nobody knows about us since we're so new a team, I guess. <laughs> ah, Pelipper! Clunk. Oh, I wonder what it could be. Hot evolutions in your area. Could this be? Neon, will you check the mailbox, please? Neon, please check the mailbox. I was going around. I'm not good with this isometric point of view. Maybe it's a rescue job offer. 
What does it say? Neon read the letter. Bzz, bzz, bzz. I heard about you from Caterpie. Please, we need your help. Magnemite is in trouble. A strange electromagnetic wave flowed through a dungeon, and it stuck together Magnemite and Magnemite. This isn't enough to form a magneton. It's not complete the way it is now. Please, we need help. Bzz, bzz, bzz. From Magnemite's friend. What do you think? Do you think we should go? Yes! That's the spirit. Let's do our best. Pose! Thunder Wave Cave! Ah, oh, this is some groove! Oh, you are here. Bzz, bzz, bzz. My friends are in this cavern. Bzz, bzz. My friends should be on basement level 6. Please help them. Bzz, bzz, bzz. On we go. Thunder Wave Cave. Defeat foes using moves instead of attacks. Instead of A attacks for more experience points. Choose and set the move you want to use. Ah, so you can set it. Select switch set moves. I'll have to see, like, uh, where it is, if it's just not replaced my A attack. More than likely, I will go back to A attacks, because A attacks are decent. Then, uh, then again, I probably should use, uh, Shane's Pound a bit more. That sounds odd. I wonder what this is. Stepped on a Wonder Tile. Stats appeared unchanged. Alright. <laughs> That's just, a uh, hey... Uh, let's see. Deselect. Because I don't want to mess up and use moves, because... Set. And let's see. Nope. I wonder how to do. It says set, so... But set to what? Maybe give more info. Nope. Hmm. Let's see... Oh, there is game options. Dungeon. Speed fast. Maybe. We'll have to see. Damage turn, yes. Grids on. Display mode. Ah, top screen. Let's try that. That seems decent. And has a nice clear. Others. Windows. Wait. Eh. Far off pals. Damage turn. Oh wait. Others. Controls. DS. I find it funny you can actually change it. Touch screen on. Sure. Quick save or give up? No. Hmm. I wish it would tell me what setting is. Maybe I should go to hints. L A U set move. Ah, it was L. I was using uh R. Rotate mode. Yep, know that. There we go. That'll be nice and quick. Yep, can't use it. Maybe because this person's in the way. So smack him. Oh, we got an apple. Picked up the apple. Eating an apple or gummy fills your belly. Oh, yeah, that function. Bob up. Choose them under items in the menu and eat one before your belly gets empty. Hmm, that makes me want to go and move to game options, dungeon. Message log, shaded map, clear map, team data, clear map. Hmm. Yeah, I'll keep it like this, actually. It appeals to me for some reason. I like having my team data up there. Oh, leave Shane alone. Yeah, absorb and heal yourself, my dude. 
and another apple. Put it in the toolbox. Stats appear unchanged. Well, I probably should have... Do not die, my friend! Ah, uh, crap. Uh. Items. Orin Berry. Uh... Use. Kill our foe! Alright, now let's see. I need to... Oop, there we go. Auto-select. And attack. That was close. A sleep seed. Throw a sleep seed at a foe to put it to sleep for a little while. Eating it will put you to sleep. Yeah, that, <laughs> that I probably should have took on that, uh, what's it, what's it called? I forget its name. Puchiana? And probably should have tried to beat it up on my own. I shall eat my orange berry myself. Granted, we heal over time, so maybe that was a bit of preemptiveness. Probably should have just used the natural healing. But hey, it's early on. There's an enemy behind us. Oh, it's... Ah, we'll hunt it down later. Now the enemies are... Now time to hunt down that poop. Chiana. You take him on. Oh, now they're running away. I'll hunt you down, Poochiana. I'll hunt you down. Because I'm a mean, mean man. Bye-bye. Level 7! Yay! I leveled up! HP went up, attack went up, defense, special attack, and special defense. And there's still a neat arena out here where you can smack down on. Grew to level 7. I did it. I leveled up. I need to preserve my tackles, methinks. Because, let's just take a look. Because <laughs> that's why I use A attacks far more than anything else. Because that was our first level here. Choose a partner with the team command and set its tactics and IQ skills. Cooperation with partners is key. All right, let's see. Shane. Uh, tactics. Let's go together. Go after foes. Avoid the first hit. Mm, I'll go let's go together because I kind of like controlling him. But, uh... Check IQ. We already did this. So that means that he can actually catch things. The Pokemon can catch and hold the thrown item. Can't make a catch if it is already holding an item. It also can't catch seeds and drink items. I guess that makes sense. You can't catch <laughs> drinks. That amuses me. I shall give to myself. Now let's see. What's a peck berry A food item that heals the Pokemon when poisoned or badly poisoned. It also slightly fills the Pokemon's belly. Rostberry. A food item that heals the Pokemon's burn. It also slightly fills the Pokemon's belly. But let's see. Summary. Wait, what's my IQ? What's my IQ? Uh, basically the same. Summary. Can we take a look at our stomach? No, I forget exactly how the stomach functions in this game. It's been so long. It's that kind of mechanic to make it so that you can't just... Uh... So you can't just go on and on. Uh, let's see. Uh, let's see, how do I quickly switch to Shane? Can, uh, maybe I should look at controls. Hints, controls. Orientation, seeds, moves, range, linking moves, Pokemon type. Oh, linking moves. Moves can be linked at the gulp and link. Oh yeah, that, that comes later. Pokemon types, blah, blah, blah. I wanna see, can I... I really just want, I guess. Hey Shane, go after the foe. There we go. 
And uh, then we'll set his tactics back. Go ahead and smack you down. How dare you! Oh yeah, corners do block moves. It was for science. Get back here, Poochiana. Quit running away! The main reason that I don't want to set him to run after enemies is because if I'm not careful, he will chase enemies to Kingdom Come, like I was kind of doing. Ah, shit. Our accuracy is terrible. I'm the only one that's been smacked up a lot. Alright. Because I don't know where to check our belly just yet. Maybe that won't activate yet, unless you're, like, terrible, like me. Wonder Tile. Oh, that heals. Those Wonder Tiles heal your statuses. Okay. It returns your stats to normal. Got you. Ah, crap. Ah, you missed. I'll smack you. You smack me, I smack you. You smack me, I smack you. We're a bunch of Pokemon gangs. Press B, then hold. Uh, hold pre B, then press to speed up movement. Hold R, right. That is R, right. Then press to move only diagonally. Ooh. A peckaberry heals any kind of poisoning. Open the B menu and select it under items. We already looked at that. Is that a rock? <gasps> we can throw rocks! I forgot! Gravel rocks can be lobbed at distant foes! Set them for use under items, then L, uh, press hold L, then R to throw them! I forgot! The rocks were one of my favorite things! This is one of my favorite things. Let's see. Uh, let's see if can I go? No, no. Hence, I need to. I know it just said it. But... L plus R throw set item. So I need to have a quip. I shall give to me. Okay, it's not working for some reason. I keep moving. My brain is just trying, like, I want to throw rocks. Let's go back. Hence, controls. L and R. Maybe... Do -do -do. Orientation. Oh. So yeah. Hmm. I want to throw rocks, but it's not working. We'll have to kill that Rattata. All right, items. Gravel rock. It's kind of a rude game. Gravel rock. Throw. Hmm, I wonder if it can be set cuz I would have that set like super you can set it, but it's kind of weird. It's, it was saying L plus R, but it wasn't doing anything. Maybe I'm just terrible. Controls. L plus R, throw 
set item. I need to set the item. Ah, I'm a fool. Not held item. Set item. <laughs> I have discovered why I am dumb. And now we shall go and set rocks as the item. There we go. All I remembered was L plus R. Where I completely missed that it needed to actually be held. Whoop, whoop. Take that. I could throw another rock at you. Dang it. <laughs> You're blocked in to doom. How many tackles do I have after all my wastes? Only five. I'm going to keep them. Fool, there's a wonder tile right there to heal me up. Oh, crap. It's a Voltorb. Leave Shane alone. Yay, we leveled up. Well, I leveled up. I got sand attack, yay! I can pocket sand so many fools. Why are you running away? Did we deal a bunch of damage to you a billion years ago? One of these rocks will hit you and murder. It's like learning to ride a bike. Yes, you kill that Radita. Good, good. Oh, getting hungry. Murder. Don't worry, we have lots of apples. Well, that's not good at all. Please don't kill me. Okay, good. You committed suicide, and I thank you for that. That's a lot of experience. I think that Pokemon was scary. Oh. I only have, like, four tech. Hello, Ella kid! Please don't murder me! Eat an apple or gummy when your belly gets down. Being famished can cause fainting, so check your belly in the menu. Ah, where? Belly, 14 of 100. Okay, thank you. Thank you, game, for answering uh, life's questions. I'm going to eat an apple. We're, we're going to have uh, horrors and terror, horrors and terrors right next to this elephant. Leave Shane alone. He is a good boy. He kind of mocked me in my interests, but he has a good heart. Oh, hey, Ornberry. And a peckerberry. I need to do th that more. There we go. Maybe this should be one of the enemies that I tackle attack more often. Hey, use moves to uh, get more experience. Well, that was a lie. That Elokid gave the same amount of experience. Ah, uh, we got Pokey. We're getting rich, Shane. We don't even need to save people. Ah, hell. We smack you, you smack me. Murder is the currency of America in this day and age. Well, then again, we aren't really. Whoop! I'm not facing the right way. I have failed my country of shining team. Yeah, I don't think there's anything down this way. Yep, should have known. You come fight me. Oh, no. Okay, that wasn't that scary. I think it was charging special. Oh, no. Yeah, I'm just going to kill. Let's escape. Basement, five floor. Whoop. More rocks! Yay! <laughs> Who knew that rocks would be one of the best items in this goddamn game? <laughs> I find it hilarious that I just went this entire time, and then... Oh, do I need to set it again? Because I ran out of rocks? I think I do. I have more rocks. More rocks. That I can throw! Oh, hell. Oh, yeah. That exists. Quick and... Moves that are multiple spaces... Happen. 
I forgot that also exists. But I just find it hilarious that one of the first things I see rocks, and I immediately go, <gasps> I can pelt people to death with rocks. It's just like the pure joy I experience at knowing that murder with rocks is now an option. Looks like rock... Just annihilating poor Pokemon with rocks is back on the menu, boys. Boss fight or just rescue? Oh, there they are. Let's get them to sit out safely. Our bodies separated. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Rejoice. Bzz, bzz. Yay. Bzz, bzz, bzz. Yay. Be thankful, you two. You are our hero. Thank you. I got 500 Pokey Dollars! And a Reviver Seed! Yay! <coughs> Rostberry isn't really that important, but... Hell yeah! Hell yeah! I'm so happy. Playing this game, I'm just super hyped at everything. I love it. I love this goddamn game. I love it. This game is so magical. I'm glad our rescue mission went well today. Actually, since this was our first job as a proper rescue team, I was really tense and nervous. But you know what else? When you're tense and nervous, you really should stay hydrated. And stay hydrated. And stay hydrated. And stay hydrated. Thank you to Mario LC for reminding me to stay hydrated while I joyously enjoy this joyous game. I'm exhausted now. I've got to go get some sleep. Let's keep up our good work tomorrow. See ya. Would you like to save your adventure? Of course. <laughs> what is this, bruh? It is one of my favorite games of all time. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon, Blue Rescue Team. Pokemon learns English, real. No, this is just one of those worlds where all of humanity died. And now Pokemon exist, except I'm a human who became a Pokemon because interdimensional shenaniganry. Where, where am I? Maybe, is this a dream? Oh, there's someone here. Who is it? Someone I know? I can't remember. I think that dream... I dreamt something. But I can't quite remember what that dream was about. Oh well. Today's another day of rescues. I wonder if I have any mail. Better check the mailbox. But what about the apples? The grand apples. I checked the mailbox, but there was no mail seeking help from rescue teams. Good morning, Neon. Aren't you up early? Oh, you, so you checked the mailbox. So was there anything? Were there any rescue requests? No, there was not. Huh? Empty? Uh, I suppose so. We've only started, after all. Well, too bad. Wanna go to Pokemon Square? I think if you go to the Polipper Post Office, there'll be jobs posted. Pokemon Square is over this way. Let's go. I have been here for two days, and only now do I head towards civilization. And this is Pokemon Square. We have the Kesslion. Yep, the Kesslion shop. You can buy and sell items there. Just various NPCs. The bank. That's Felicity Bank. You can save your money there. This is the Gulpin Link shop. Gulpin can link moves for you. Huh? What's linking? Well, if you link moves, you can use them at the same time. I think you should ask Gulpin if you want to know more. And Kangaskhan! This is Kangaskhan's storage. If you store items here, they'll never go missing. You should store important items here before you go out on any dungeon adventure. What do you think? The businesses here help us. Oh, and there's also the Polipper Post Office that's up past here. I think we can get some information on rescue jobs. Let's first go to the Plipper Post Office. But I want to talk to people. Hello, Kesslyon. Hello. Welcome to the Kesslyon shop. Is it? Oh, uh, very well. What do you wish to sell? Ah, very well. What do you wish to sell? 
I am not selling you my gravel rocks. My rocks are very important to me. Hmm. I shall save this for now, because I don't know when I might need these. But what do you have to sell, my fine Kesslyon friend? Feel free to examine my merchandise. We got some uh, gravel rocks that we can buy. And then a severely, severely expensive reviver seed. I have one free. And uh, and a big apple. What's a big apple? I want info on the big apple. A food item that amply fills the Pokemon's belly. Eating this when its belly is full will slightly enlarge its belly size. That sounds disturbing. How disturbing. Thank you. Please call again. Welcome to Kesslyon Wares, the shop for orbs and TMs. These are going to be super expensive. Torment, Escape Orb, and Hurl Orb. What is this orb? Her uh, range, foe in front. Hurls the target at another foe to inflict damage. Oh, like, hurls the target at another foe. So I was like, I wonder what is the specifics, but Torment. Teaches the move Torment. It prevents the targeted Pokemon from repeating its last move while it remains on the floor. I don't know why Pokemon are selling CDs and they work, but whatever. I shall leave for now. Hello there, Bellsprout, you horrid abomination. Luckily, I don't think you know rap, so I shall forgive you of your kind sins in the human world and uh, get to know you on a uh, new, new, this new world. There was a forest fire not long ago. It was terrible. Luckily, Blastoise and Feraligator were able to douse it quickly, but it could have been so much worse if they were slower getting there. Lombre. I don't know why, but there have been many natural disasters lately. A lot of Pokemon have gone wild and violent because the disasters scared them. It's a mean world out there. Pardon. Or oh, the Palepa Post Office. The Palepa Post Office would be straight down this path. Be out of the cape. You can't miss it. Snub em. Hello, Gulpin. Hello, welcome to the Gulpin Link Shop. Link moves all you like for just 150 pokey. Sure thing, what do you need information on? Remembering moves. What if you had to forget a move but you wanted it back? Ever face that situation? No, because I'm a new Pokemon. I only learned my fourth move sand attack just yesterday. Mike can help. Come to me and I can make you instantly remember forgotten moves. I, well, when Pokemon remember, I love seeing that instant. That look of enlightenment. That amazed look of pleasure. Eh, you stay away from my pleasure. I run this business because I live to see that moment. Welcome to the Gulpin Link Shop. Tell me about, uh, linking moves. When moves are linked, two or more moves, two or more? can be used one after another in one turn. For example, if the moves Scratch and Growl are linked, both Scratch and Growl are used in one turn. See, amazing, huh? Using links, <laughs> well, depending on the moves you link, you can get incredible results. Oh yes, when moves are linked, they are used in sequence from the top one first. You can also separate linked moves by selecting the delink command. The sequence of moves can be changed by pressing R, then pressing up or down. Try to innovate with links. Try creating links of your very own. Hmm. And then setting, just to make sure I have all the information. When you're in a dungeon and you're about to use a move, isn't it a pain to open a window each time? You can avoid that. You can just conveniently set the move for instant use. A set move can be instantly used with L and A. See, isn't it easy? Just set the move, hold L and then press A to use it. It's very convenient. You can also switch the set move in a dungeon. Do try it out. I guess I'll go ahead and link moves. I shall link... a Tail Whip. Yeah, that works. Now, Tail Whip will happen. Then Tackle will happen, so I do extra damage. It'll be amazing. 
And I'll leave his stuff alone for now. Shall we go on? Sure. Oh. Nope. Whenever you get the urge to link moves, please come see me. Hey, Kangaskhan. Hello there. Welcome to Kangaskhan Storage. I can store items that you found in dungeons or that you bought from shops. If you faint in a dungeon, your items will be lost. But what's in storage will be safe. I keep guard over the storage space, so anything you leave with me won't ever disappear. If you have any moves that you can't bear to lose, any items, moves, I'll for I got amnesia what I lost in the dungeon. Be sure to leave them with me. Anything else, dear? I would like to store items. What do you want to store? You can choose more than one item using L or R. I shall throw in... I don't think I'll need the sleep seed. Well, let's see. Uh, I'll keep the reviver seed just in case. One apple. Well, actually, two apples. I'll keep some orange berries. Just in case. And my gravel rocks. I'll put the items you chose in storage, okay? Okay, stored away. You can count on me, honey. Do you want to store anything else? No, thank you. Thank Mrs. Kangaskhan. Thank you, sweetie. Come again. Mak Makuhita Dojo. I forget if I ever came down here. There appears to be no one inside. There's a notice posted in the back, under construction. Keep out. Okay. We'll just have to come back later. It's been so long that certain things only smack back into reality after something happens. Wish Cash Pond. Like, the rocks. I find a rock and I immediately be like, this is a wonderful item of murder. I've heard fissures have opened up in the ground here and there. They're trouble for everyone. It worries me to no end, thinking that children will fall down them. What a thoughtful wish, Cash. I wonder if he ever wonders if he'll escape his pond. Welcome. This is Felicity Bank. How may I serve you? I would like to store some money, please. Uh, all of it right now. 724 pokey, very well. I will guard it jealously. Your account contains... Um, I shall leave for now. I await your next visit. And uh, Jigglypuff, or whatever puff that was there, is not there yet. They come in later when we have money to buy areas for allies. That building is the Polipper Post Office. Nah, I never would have guessed. It's only a building that looks like a Polipper. This is where information is gathered from Pokemon needing rescue in various locations. See, have a look at this bulletin board. It lists rescue jobs. Check it out. Let's take it out. Tiny Woods, Tiny Woods, Thunder Cave. There's three Thunder Caves and two Tiny Woods. I think I'll take the Thunder Caves. Help me! Info. I'm famished. Someone! Client, Pidgey. Objective, help me. Place, Thunder Wave Cave, placement three. A hundred pokey. I shall accept. I can't get home. I was attacked when I was sitting still. Why? Why is everyone attacking me? Another Pidgey in basement floor four. I shall take. I'm scared. I lost in a battle. Aye! Client Voltorb. Ooh, plus question mark. I shall take that as well. And I forget what happens to the ones you don't do. Like, uh, you can accept them, but if you don't do them, I think something happens to them. See? There were jobs listed, right? To do a rescue job, you first select it with accept. Then on the job list, choose the job, then confirm it with take job on the rescue mission. If you don't select take job, you can't do that rescue job even if you go out to the dungeon. Since we're just starting up, we should handle the jobs that are posted here. Our team name will get better known by that. I think that will bring job offers to our mailbox. And if you want to go on a rescue mission, choose the job on the job list. Then select Take Job. Try to always do that before you leave. Let's talk to the Palipper. 
I'm your guide to what you can expect at the Polipper Post Office. Post Office. The Polipper Post Office keeps track of information from around the world. We inform folks about everything from gossip to calls from help from Hello Pokemon. For the latest news, check your mailbox or the bulletin board outside, alright? Oh, that's not all. You can arrange for a friend rescue mission at the counter there. The left counter is for rescues. The right counter is for thank you mail. Did you want to ask about anything else? Uh, delivery? If your rescue team becomes famous for doing lots of rescues, expect to get rescue requests directly. Our delivery polipper will take those jobs straight to your mailbox. Do you want to ask about anything else? Hello, I handle thank you mail. I don't know how that works, so I shall leave. Bad. Just for science. I'm. Oh, deliver one orange berry, but I'll accept that and see what happens. Ratata hasn't come back. A rescue team is urgently needed. I'll accept them and see what happens. Job list. I shall take fun away with Cave. We don't have any points. We put away all our money. Oh, we can do jobless from there, too. Mm, I can't talk to my friend from Sadness. Onwards back to town so we can venture out, maybe. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Da 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 da. Welcome, the fun and bustling Pokemon Square. I would like to go Thunderwave Cave. We've got apples. We've got orange berries. I should have bought more rocks. But oh well, I'm sure we can find some rocks in here. You have been found. Tail Whip and Tackle for the ultimate murder. You thought you could run, but you cannot, for I have rocks! Ah, a sleep seed, huh? Your sleep seed is now mine, as I put you to sleep permanently. Don't try to run away! Grew to level nine, yay! I leveled up. HP by three, attack by two, a defense by one. Special attack, two, special defense, one. Ah, nothing nowhere that way, man. I just find it, I still enjoy the fact that I just get rocks. My immediate thing just went, yay, rocks. I get to kill people with rocks. Now my boy Shane grew up in the level. I did it! Level up! HP by three, attack by two, defense by two. A special attack by two, and special defense by two. Nice round numbers. And that's the way to continue, but we're not speeding. We're here to annihilate everyone. And I do need to be careful because clients do show up on the floor. And you don't want to murder them. Blast Seed. A uh, Blast Seed. A blast seed flames the foe you are facing. Turn to face the foe, then use the item. You are about to face a horrible fate. Now you are dead. <laughs> rescue teams, we're here to rescue some, murder others. You're gonna give back that fecking apple. Give back the apple! Apple is mine! That's my apple. Uh, somebody is stealing my rocks! Damn it, I shouldn't have done that. At least I'm getting more rocks. I reimbursed myself two rocks. I completely failed, my friend. And luckily, it completely failed itself. And now it is dead. Another Blast Seed. That'll come in handy if I ever run into rogue... Uh, grass types that want my giblets. 
He's like, <laughs> it's just an Eevee. We're wondrous grass types. We're gonna beat you up. Chew on a seed. Flavor. And, uh... There we go. That works for me. Would you love to get elemental attacks just by eating a seed? Come here. Come here. Die. And now we move on. Our first client should be on this floor. You've reached a destination floor. And remember, the game will probably ask you to, hey, you did thing, would you like to leave? For a moment, I was like, wait, is that the Voltorb I need to rescue? No, that's on the fifth floor, I think. No clients yet. More rocks. Ah, shit. Die. Puchiana. You're not very smart, are you? Neither is Shane. Neither are you. Why? Well, yeah, I forgot. I'm already leveling up like crazy because I'm hunting down every Pokemon in this place. Hey, Pidgey. Uh, can I talk to you? Pidgey was found. I shall save you. The rescue team badge shown on Pidgey. Pidgey gained a magical power. Pidgey. Thank you. Please come to see me at the Polipper Post Office later. Pidgey escaped the dungeon. A mission has been completed. Would you like to leave now? No. Continue on with your adventure. Yes. It's kind of rude that the game has the frickin' Oh, would you like to end your adventure here highlighted? So in Pokemon Generation uh, 1 and 2, it's like, Oh, you, you don't get to decide if you leave. You don't get to be like, Oh, I want to just be... I'm gonna throw a rock at you for that. You growl at me from a distance? Like how sound works? How dare you? All that way to go. Whoop! Thank you, speed up. And that's not even an emulator thing. That's actually in the game. Cause, wait, another Poochiana we can murder. Time to gang up on a Poochiana, I'm fucked up. I always fear that I'm going to press a movement button, and I basically have the same effect of doing a movement button. You've reached a destination floor. I basically miss out on movement either way. Me, I'm fool. Ah, an Orenberry. Yay. An Ella kid, I think, is chasing my, uh... Whoop! Whoop! Die. Pound that Ella kid. Pound him in the butt! With his own butt. Ah, fuck. Time for murder. This is Elekid Central, here to murder me. I'm getting hungry. I better eat an apple. Apple. Hey, eat an apple, get an apple. The apple economy is thriving. Hello, Pidgey. Pidgey was found. I rescue you! Thank you. Please come see me at the Polypper Post Office later. Escape the dungeon. I would like to continue my mission. I shall continue my adventure. There is still a Voltorb here that needs saving on the next level. Wow, I haven't seen you. Leave! Quit it! Would you like to join our company? I don't have your area yet. I think you were a rare Pokemon. <laughs> Damn it. I actually think that he was a rare Pokemon. Well, yeah, kind of, basically, each area has a set type of Pokemon and amount of Pokemon that can spawn in there. So, I think that mm, uh, Minen might be a... Pokemon that only sometimes appears in this place. Kind of like a, ooh, 1 in 10 chance for a Pokemon to spawn and be a mining kind of thing. Of course not 
actual numbers. It's just me spitballing, throwing the example out there. Yeah, I think that's just the way. So onwards to the next destination level. Basement 5. Hey, it's right here. Hello, friend. I shall save you. Rescue Team Badge shown on Voltorb. Voltorb Gang to Magical Power. Thank you. Please come to see me at the Polymer Post Office later. You know, escape the dungeon. I would like to continue onwards, because there are items to be had. And I should be able to survive on the... I shouldn't have to use any orin berries or apples. In fact... So I should be... Rat bastard. You're gonna die. How dare you block my way! I just saved one of your brethren! But now I must murder you. Hey, another another mining! Maybe they're not as rare as I thought. It's just kind of funny. You're the second one I've run into here. When I ran into none of you before. Well, that's not good at all. Rock. Fuck. Rock. Quit it! I'm being assaulted! I'm being assaulted, Peanut. I murdered your friend. How do you feel about that? You know, in all actuality, that could have just been a different rescue team here on a mission, and they're like, rogue Pokemon. And we're like, rogue Pokemon. And then we just bashed each other. Really, they should have just shown their, uh, their rescue team badge if they weren't a bad guy. Which means they probably were a bad guy. Hello, friend. You're going to die. We're the best rescue team. We murder everyone we see. I think I actually have accidentally killed an ally before. Like, a uh... Wow, we got a lot of experience for doing that. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward. A hundred pokey. And five rescue points. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward, a hundred pokey. And rev Reviver Seed! He gave me basically $900 of pokey. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward, a hundred pokey. And Reviver Seed! <laughs> I get a Reviver Seed, I howl. Didn't we do a good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. Okay, see you tomorrow. I got so much genius money-making dollars right there. Two Reviver Seeds. That is a hundred and... Well, not a hundred. A thousand six hundred Pokey worth. Oh no. I'm, my home's gonna get invaded in the night. Again? Am I dreaming again? It's that Pokemon again. Huh? They're talking to me? I can't hear them clearly. What are they saying? Huh, it's shaking. An earthquake? Oh, it's getting worse. For a dream, this feels strangely real, but... Oh, fuck, it is real, isn't it? The next morning. Well, my water didn't splash everywhere, and my apples are undisturbed. Uh, hello? Who's there? Hello, uh, you are Neon, aren't you? Where are you? Oh, you can't see us. Of course. How very rude of us. Oh! We're pleased to meet you. We are Doug Trio. Last night during the earthquake, our child Diglett was attacked. He was whisked away to the peak of a tall mountain. We couldn't possibly climb somewhere so high. This is why we must call upon you for your help, Neon. Diglett was abducted by a Pokemon named Skarmory. It's why a vilely vicious ruffian. Please do be careful. Please, we need your help. We must go. How did it get whisked away by a... It's a, it's a Diglett. You can't pull it out of the ground. That was so sudden. There was no time to even say no. It's too bad. I better go. <laughs> it's too bad. I wanted to say no. Good morning, Neon. Huh? You were just asked to go on a rescue mission? Yes! Our child, Diglett, was kidnapped! 
He was taken to Mount Steel's summit. Please, we need your help. Bye-bye. Uh, okay. Let's go. Check mail. Welcome to a rescue team. Read. To all new members, your badge has the power to send back to town any Pokemon you've rescued. Just hold the badge up and it does the rest. By completing rescue jobs, you will be awarded points that raise your team's ranking. Aim for the bronze rank for now. Pokemon Rescue Organization. Well, we uh, can't really say no. And no Pokemon news, but let's go do some shopping. Da, 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 rah, rah, rah. No puff puff yet. Hello, Gulpin. Ba, 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 ba. Hello there. Welcome to Kangaskhan Storage. What do you want to store? Uh huh. Uh. Sleep seed, blast seed, apple. Yeah, we definitely do. We want to just open all of this up. And uh, a few orange berries for the road and a few apples. I'll put the items you chose in storage, okay? Okay, stored away. You can count on me, honey. Do you want to store anything else? Hmm. Let's see. Orenberry, 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 Orenberry. And uh, two apples, one reviver seed. I think that'll be good. And me add uh, items. I can't give items yet. Give Orenberry. I shall give you an orange berry, so that we just have them nice and easy. You got any super items for me, Kesslyon Purple Man? Secret Power Info Teaches the move Secret Power and inflicts damage on the target and may also trigger other effects depending on the terrain. Hmm, interesting. But uh, not all that great right now. Now if it were Iron Tail, because I just, I, I love that move. Let's see, big apples, uh, no more rocks. I will save my money for now. Thank you, Kesslyon bros. Oh, oh, yep, yeah, we already asked this. You do not have anything else to say. Still in the forest? There was a forest fire not that long ago. You're just hooked on that, aren't you? And uh, that leads me to believe Lombre would say the same thing. Welcome. This is Felicity Bank. Your account contains Diddly D. I shall store all my money. How much you wish to deposit? Thank you very much, Felicity Bank. I think that Persian may be heading up a criminal organization. Well, bulletin board is uh, broken down. They don't want you to do jobs. They want you to go do mission to save Diglett, even though we do have some tiny forest missions. Well, let's go ahead and head to Mount, uh, Mount uh, Steel. I love the overworld map. It looks so good. Mount Steel. Here we are. Mount Steel. So Diglett was whisked to its peak. That's right. The peak is nine floors up. Thank you for helping. Farewell. They just go super hard. Uh, let's go. Mount Steel, first floor. Well, we found the way up, but we have rocks to gather, orange berries to gather, items to gather, and foes to destroy. Of course, we are quite low on foes right now. Huh. Rock. Uh, smack that dude, please. Not very effective, still did super good. Well, that's doubly not good. Rock! Rock! I need to be careful with my... 
Oh crap, you're a three hit. That's not good at all. Especially if I miss. Well, that refunds my rocks. Nope. Ah, uh, crap. Give me back my rock! I'm gonna tackle attack! Ah, oh, shit. Kill! Kill the steel boy! Hello, Zigzagoon. Ah, uh, that's just my life right now. Please kill. That was way too close. Next enemy that comes, I'm gonna have to take cover behind Shane. And I don't think a rock will help here. Leave Shane alone and kill! Jesus Christ, that Spiro, you know, Spiro is just super angry. Please, don't do that. Luckily, we have a... Doop. There we go. Very rude. I need to be careful. Ah, oh, fuck. This place is more dangerous than I thought. Press onwards. That was floor one of nine. You can just go back and forth, heal up. Come fight me. Maha. Crap. Maha. Well, that's not good at all. Enemies are pouring out of every orifice of this place. Jesus. You scare me with your twister, and I don't want... Yay! It has Twister, which is scary for Shane, but not terrible. Looks like it's gonna be a full loop of a place, and there's not that many items today. Thank you for submitting yourself to death. What moves do I have? I do have Helping Hand, but that only raises a certain thing, so I'm gonna smack you. I just healed that. If only you could give me some of that absorb power, my boy. This 74 pokey will cover the medical pills. My defense is so low. Maybe there'll be a wonder tile up in here. Nope. But there is stair. Well, this ain't good. Rock. Rock. That's actually not good. Okay, that's actually not that bad. I thought the gust would do super damage for whatever reason. Okay, that was that a crit? That did six... Okay, or maybe we're just doing mega damage now for no reason. Uh... Hello, boy. I've got rocks with your name on it. And my face with your name on it. Without the implications, of course. And I hate you, so I'm gonna whap me with my tail and kill you. Whoop! Smack him with your face! Is it just me, or did all these enemies become easier to kill when we went up floors? Hmm, our belly is still doing decent, I guess. Maybe I should have gotten a big, big apple to begin this. 
But we do have rocks. We can throw them at Charlie Brown later. You can harden all you like, but you will still die! Well, that doesn't work out in my favor. Weapon with your tail! And kill! Oh no. Stop hardening! Start dying! It's only when they use moves, and I don't know when they use moves. And nothing to change, so onwards we go! No, this definitely feels like a mountain. Well, just wait until we get to the frickin' 100 level Palooza of Nightmares. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. Oh, just for that, I'm gonna throw another rock at you. Yeah, later on, levels get crazy. With just the amount of levels they throw at you. How oh, many moves do I still have? Uh, this is gonna be our first boss fight, so we need to be careful. We want to have moves to just blast. I probably should have brought some blast seeds. There's a sleeping Pokemon in the corner, but I'm scared. Kill. Getting hungry. Time to eat apple. Probably should have brought more apples. Well, we do have orange berries, so we'll be able to dig ourselves out of a ditch. Ah, <gasps> a blast seed. That'll come in handy against the steel type Skarmory. At least I think so. I can only assume. Get out of here, Aaron. Go back to the game, Grumps. If I missed, that would have been actually very bad. I'm gonna throw a rock, and I'm gonna smack you. I'm gonna throw a rock, and I'm gonna smack you. Preventative measures. I'm gonna throw a rock. How many rocks do I have? Eleven. I have a lot of rocks. And I'm willing to throw him. Rock. Ah, I forgot that it acts as a turn because I'm stupid. And then I took a tackle to the face. We can only uh, heal for so much. Up we go. Ay ay ay. Yeah, that also happens. I wanted to lure it away into the open spaces. Ah, an orange berry. Well, we could have missed out on that. You can try and harden all you like. You will still die! One must wonder what happens to these Pokemon. After we beat them up and... It, I was gonna say, ooh, maybe it implies that they just run away, but I don't think so. If mainly because... They do run away if they take... Sometimes if they take enough damage, they'll run away. A bunch of Poochianas. You scare me, your fighting type die. Fighting type was gonna break my normal ass. We'll let him live, he's sleeping. And we wanna not waste too much movement and uh, power points on things. Just an enemy. Ah, uh, crap, Metacham. Oh, no, not Metacham. Metatite. Die. I was gonna be worried there for a second that he would just never die and actually unleash a bite that would kill me. Because if I'm correct, bite stores up power and then just annihilates you. 
It, t it stores power dependent on how much damage you take. And then... Hippity-hoppity, life goes on. Oh, God. We're not gonna have a lot... I'm gonna be relying on that goddamn burn seed. Blast seed. Three more floors. Ah, changed. Cool. Do we have any other apples? Nope. That's not good. <gasps> a gummy! Gummies are important. Orange gummy. Let's read up on that. Info. A food item that somewhat fills Pokemon's belly. When given to a rescue team member, it raises the Pokemon's IQ. Fighting type like it best. We don't have any, so, uh... Give to Shane. And, uh... Ah, goddammit. We're wasting moves with this. You will eat this gummy, but I have to give it to you. And then order you to eat it. <coughs> IQ Rose, PP Checker. Come to me. Ah, crap. And there's an enemy out here that's hogging some pokey. If we wanted to. We could just leave. Ah, hell. No longer hell. That way, I think, is just going to be a dead end. This will be the last room we check. No items. Well, that's not nice at all. Leave my friend alone! I lied, we're actually going to go do more. Ah, good, we leveled up. Yay, I leveled up! And Shane leveled up! Ooh, and he learned Quick Attack. That's awesome. Kinda wish I had that, because that's a move that can hit, like, two moves in front of you. Two moves in front of you. Two, uh, diddly-dees in front of you. Like that. Ah, so that does work! He's gonna help a lot in tunnels now! That's gonna really help during the tunnel segments of these places. And gives him a thing to use against Skarmory. Maybe. Ooh, a seed. Another blast seed. Crap. You're scary. And uh, a rare Pokemon, which makes you... Do not cut me in half. You could've just killed him. Kill him! Kill! <laughs> It's like, the giant bug has me in a vice, gr vice grip. And frickin' my dude. Uh, could you use quick attack? I guess I can't order you to do it. Which is sad. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. Ah, thank you. That's exactly what I wanted, my dude. A hurl orb. Your face makes me want to hurl. <laughs> Humor has been detected. And then I'm gonna throw a rock. And then I'm gonna pound you with my face. I don't even need to know the word, the the move pound. Well, at least you're not a Magneton. Congratulations. Your only move can hurt yourself, and now you're dead. He stole experience from me. Bastard. Let's move on. We don't want to run out of, uh... We only have so much. Like rocks. That's not exactly what I wanted. I failed. gonna check the rooms on either side and get loaded up on rocks. 
God damn it. Quick attack this dude. Shane, please. Thank you. Just heal up a bit, heal up a bit, heal up a bit. Yes, I know. Onwards we go. Boss fight time. Look, Neon! Diglett's over there! Hey, are you alright? We've come to s rescue you! I... I'm scared! You! What do you think you're doing here? We're here to rescue Diglett! Skarmory, don't do this! Release Diglett! How dare you! It's their fault! I haven't slept in days because the earthquakes frighten me so. Every night we've had them. Those earthquakes are caused by this brat's ilk running wild underground. That's not true. Well, it's true that there have been many earthquakes lately, but it would take more than Diglett's family going wild under the ground to cause earthquakes. Quiet, you! We'll fight if you keep that up. It's no good. Skarmory's too agitated to listen to reason. We'll have to fight it out. Rock. Hey. Blast Seed. Well, that's not good at all. Luckily, he died. And we got a bunch of experience. Dear God, it did a lot of damage to my boy. I can't keep up. I'll flee for now. Hey there! We chased Skarmory off! It's okay now! Come down over here! I can't! I'm too scared to move! Okay, no problem. We'll come to you, just wait. Whoa! Sheesh, look at this cliff! I can't see the bottom! Neon, what do we do? We can't get across like this! <laughs> oh, hi! You're the Magnemite we saved! We got word of this. We uh, can rescue Diglett from the sky. Hold on to us tight. Don't be scared. We won't make the mistake of zapping you. He's a ground type, so it wouldn't really do that much anyway. Oh, I was very scared. Maybe because I was somewhere up so oh, high. My feet feel like they're still walking on air. Feet? He has them. Feet? Well, you're safe now. That's what counts. <laughs> Crazy Pokemon Mystery Dungeon lore. Diglett have feet. <laughs> Granted, they pulled him... They... The, 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 the Magnemites brought him down. Wouldn't they have seen the feet? Yes, thank you very much. Oh, you've been rescued. Great, great. Huh? What was that? Am I hearing voices? Whoops, you can't see us. That's terribly rude of us. Hello, Doug Trio here. Oh, Papa. Diglett, you had us worried. You're not hurt? Nope, that was very scary, but I'm all right. It's all thanks to Neon's team. Thank you for everything. You are heroes. You should be thanking our Magnemite friends. This rescue was impossible for us to do on our own. Oh, how rude of us! Thank you so much! No, no, it was only the right thing to do. And how both our evolved forms are joined trios. I felt a certain kinship. After all, Pokemon must help each other. I'm impressed. Sincerely, thank you. We must be going, Neon. Shane, thank you. Farewell! 500 Pokey, and a P.E.K.K.A. Scarf, and the item Ginseng. We'll be on our way to... Oh, wait, don't go away. What is it? Uh, would you like to join our team? Join your team. Yeah, we couldn't have done the last job if you weren't around, Magnemite. I thought we would need more help for doing rescues in the future. Neon, you don't mind, we need more members. So how about it? Will you join us as members of our rescue team? Rescue team. That sounds fun. But if you need us to rush over to rescues, we need somewhere to live close by. 
Is there anywhere we can live in this area? Um, well, oh, there isn't. Too bad. Sorry, but we can't join you. See you. And this is where Wigglytuff starts selling things to us. That is too bad. It looks like we need to find places for Pokemon to live if we want some to join our rescue team. I know! Let's go to Pokemon Square tomorrow! There's an interesting place called the Wigglytuff Club. It wasn't open the other day when we went to the square. It should be open tomorrow, though. It's next door to the Felicity Bank. Wigglytuff is usually there every day. We may be able to get some information. Okay, that's what we'll do tomorrow. We'll go to Pokemon Square. Would you like to save your reinvention? Of course I would. Why would I want to forget about my adventure? It would be quite terrible. Time for another hallucination dream. Again? It's that dream again. Who's Gadavoa? My waifu is looking over me. That Pokemon. Who could it be? Huh? I'm hearing better this time. What? Human? My role? Wait, please, tell me more. I can't. Drifting off. If that just ain't the way dreams be sometimes. The next morning. Gotta drink some water, gotta eat some apple. An apple a day keeps the dark rye away. Morning, Neon. <laughs> What's the matter? You haven't woken up yet? Oh? You've been having strange dreams. What was the strange about about? What was strange about them? Neon told Shane about the dreams. Uh, okay. Neon, you said you're actually a human, right? So maybe those dreams have some connection to how you became a Pokemon. By the way, Neon, what do you want to do? Do you want to turn back into a human? It's true. I haven't thought about it much, but do I want? I'm not sure. Huh? What's wrong? Is this a dilemma for you? Well, I hope so. It sure must be more fun to be here with me. <laughs> anyway, we're supposed to go to the Pokemon Square today. Do you remember? We need to get information on how we can add members to our rescue team. Let's get going. But the mailbox! The mailbox has been robbed. Welcome to the Kesslyon shop. Shop. <gasps> b -b -b bullet seed! But it's six billion dollars! What is the Hurl Orb? Hurls the target at another flow. Uh, don't really care, so I shall sell it. Hurl Orb, you say? For that, I can offer 150 Pokey. Fine, fine. We have a deal. Thank you so much. And a Warp. Warp's foe is in the same room to other places on the same floor. Uh, not really all that useful. It might have some utility, but I'm not seeing it. I'm too busy killing. Well, let's see. What is, uh, Gensing? Info. A drink that boosts the power of the Pokemon set move. It may not have any effect on certain kinds of moves. It also slightly feels... Hmm. I wonder if it's a permanent boost. Info. A hold item that prevents the Pokemon from being poisoned or badly poisoned. The Pokemon takes damage... Oh, that's just telling me. Badly poisoned is worse. Okay, dog. Huh, Snubble ain't here. There have been some natural disasters, more Pokemon starting. Oh, that's actually different. More Pokemon are starting to make their own rescue teams. Oh my gosh, the fort file while back was simply awful. I hightailed it out of there. Hello there, welcome to Kangaskhan Storage. What do you want to store? Decent chunk of, uh, leaves. I need to bring some apples out of storage. And then I would, uh, like to take. I want to take out more apples. Let's 
because we always need to go about with as many as we can. And then I will wear the P.E.K.K.A. scarf until we have a better idea of what to do. I'll quickly go talk to Wish Cash. And then we'll probably take out all our money and buy a bunch of places from Wigglytuff. Real estate! I've lived in this pond for many long years, but never have I seen such frequent natural disasters. It must be a sign! Groudon must be to blame! Welcome to this Felicity Bank. I would like to take all the money. Bye bye. Friends are my treasures. Welcome to Wigglytuff Club, a circle of friends. Huh? Is this your first visit here? Oh, I get it. You started a rescue team too, didn't you? You've come to the right place. I sell friend areas to add members to your rescue team. Since you're here for the very first time, I'll give you two free and friend areas for free. Let's do it. Wigglytuff, Wigglytuff, let's be friends. Congratulations! You can go to the Wild Plains now. You can also go to the Mist Rise Forest. Now you can recruit Pokemon that live in these two friend areas. How do you recruit new friend members? Well, if you're finding Pokemon that live in a friend area, sometimes they will come to admire you as a friend. If I beat the shit out of you hard enough, you'll love me as a friend. In that case, they may ask to join your team. Just keep trying. If you're giving friend areas away, can you also give my friends access to the power plant friend area? I also want to join their rescue team. Okay, gotcha. I'm giving it away today. Wiggly tough, wiggly tough. Let's be friends. Ta! Congratulations. You can go to the power plant now. Yes, now I can join their team. Yay. Sorry, I know my friend turned down your offer to join your team yesterday, but after mulling it over last night, my friend developed an overwhelming desire to become your team member. I apologize, but could you allow my friend to join your team? Oh, wow, don't forget, we were the ones that asked your friend to join us. So yes, that'd be awesome. Glad to have your friend on board. All right, good on you. Do your best and try to not hinder your rescue teammates. Yeah, I'll do my best. Yay! Magnemite became a team member. Ah. Huh. I shall give you a name. So I can grow attached to you. I don't know why, but you seem like a Terry. You are now Terry. I'll be resting up in the power plant friend area. If you want me along for a rescue, come get me at the power plant. Okay. Bzz, bzz, bzz. You can go to your friend areas by taking the left path from your rescue team base. There's a sign on the path to the left of your rescue team base, so you shouldn't have any trouble. That's all the giveaways today. If you want more friend areas, you'll have to buy them now. Friends are my treasures. Welcome to Wigglytuff Club. Check. Which Pokemon would you like to check? Skarmory. It is Ravaged Field. It's, that's cool. You actually can check. What can I buy? You'd like to add to your friend areas? Which one would you like? Ooh. There are some that are expensive and some that are cheap. I guess I'll buy Mount Deep Green. A mountainous area with lush plant life and deliciously fresh air. Pokemon are happy to live in this bountiful area. Mount Deep Green, that will be 130 Pokey, is that okay? Gotcha, let's do it! Wigglytuff, Wigglytuff, let's be friends, yup ta! Congratulations, you can go to Mount Deep Green now. You can recruit Pokemon that live in the dirt friend area, Mount Deep Green. Would you like another friend area? Info, a lovely area, fantastic view, safari. Flyaway Forest. 
Mushroom Forge. Rub-a-dub River. Tadpole Pond. Safari seems... I'm gonna get Safari just because it has just a ton of Pokemon that I can get in there. Wait, I also wanna see. Jungle? Well, how many for Peanut Swamp? Not that many. It has to be very specific ones. Decrepit Lab. Not that many. Meta Titan Tyrogue. Thunder Meadow. Oh, that's how I get mining. Ravaged Field. Magnetic <laughs> Quarry. Only three. Wow. I want so many. I'm going to buy so many. But let's see. Safari? Definitely. I can't multi-select. I want Safari. Safari? That'll be 700 Pokey. Is that okay? Gotcha. Let's do it. Wiggly tap, wiggly tap, let's be friends. You pop! Congratulations, you can go to Safari now. You can recruit Pokemon that live in the friend area Safari. Would you like to add other friends? Hmm. I, oh, I don't know. I don't know. Mount Discipline has a decent amount that I've already ran into. Let's see. And I guess Flyaway Forest for the bird types that we might run into. Flyaway Forest, that'll be 550 Pokey, is that okay? Gotcha. Let's do it. Wiggly tap, wiggly tap, let's be friends. Yum ta! Congratulations, you can go to Flyaway Forest now. You can recruit Pokemon that live in the friend area of Friendaway Forest. Friendaway Forest, where you send your friends to die. I think that'll do it for now. Anything else? Thank you. Come again. We're all friends here. That's why you have to give me a shit ton of money. Thank you, Felicity Bank. We shall go. Gathered up items. Items? A ton for Mount Steel, huh? Ah, dang it. I have to... I'll give up this tiny forest one so that we can have another Mount Steel. Let's see. They're gonna give me rocks for saving their friend. Pidgey appeared to be freezing. I don't care who it is. Please help! Poochiana. But let's see. There was a hubbub back at the bub bub. There's hubbub back, back at the hub, bub. Huh? What's going on over there? There seems to be a commotion. Please help my friend. Please, I need help. Forget it. We're not about to work for that. But my friend needs a gust of wind. Please help. Hi, what's going on? Huh? That scene there? Jump Love's begging for a rescue mission, but not finding any luck. See that guy? They are the one in the middle with the pointy nose. He's a Pokemon named Shiftry. He's got his own rescue team. But his team is greedy. They don't work unless they get paid royally. Jumpluff's been begging for help, but I feel sorry for that poor Pokemon. Wait! Wait. Oh, what do you want? Oh, it's Alakazam. Much Alakazam? Hey, rather cold-hearted, aren't you? To save Jumpluff's friend, a strong wind is needed. Your leafy fans can whip up powerful winds. It's an easy matter for you. Help that Pokemon out. <laughs> okay, we'll do it! And then they went to the Wishcast Pond. Wow! That shift tree agreed without any argument. Say, who are they? What? You don't know? It's Alakazam's team! They're the most famous rescue team around these parts. That's Charizard. His flamethrower can melt mountains! That's Tyranitar. He takes great pride in his armored body and amazing strength. And that's the leader, Alakazam. Alakazam doesn't like physical attacks. He fights with his psychic powers. 
He's endowed with an amazing brain and an IQ of 5,000. <laughs> that's embellished. Apparently, he's memorized everything that's happened in the world. Alakazam does all the commanding in the team. He's clearly in charge. Thank you. No need for thanks. It is only natural that you get help. If anyone turns you down again, come see me. Take care. C cool. I would be less from the gold rank rescue team. Expect less. Wah! What's wrong? What's up? It's fine. Nothing. Let's go. He knows. He knows more than what's on. Ooh, that was scary. Shish. Cool. Whoa, Neon. We need to become like them. Let's recruit more members and make our rescue team first class. Not if I can help it. <laughs> what a bastard. The next morning. Let me get Shift Tree just throw Jump Luff somewhere else. Throw Jump Luff to hell! Good morning, Neon. Ah, time for mail! Mail. Mail, 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 mail. Welcome, Re Rescue Team Basics! Saving your adventure in Pokemon News! You can now, you can save your adventure by going to your bed. Get in the habit of saving often. You should also store old Pokemon news. If your mailbox is full, you won't get the latest issue of the Pokemon news or any job mail. Check the mailbox and store old news. Okay, we'll store. Ah, that's how you do it. It goes to the Pokemon news. One switcher orb. I don't think we have a switcher orb. I have half a mind to delete that one, but we're gonna go, let's go to town, see if there's a switcher orb for sale. Hello. You got a switcher orb? He wouldn't sell a switcher orb anyway. You got a switcher orb? Let's see, job list. Faint Faint hasn't come back yet. Orenberry, Peckaberry, and Scared. Hmm. Suspend for now. Gravel Rock. Gravel Rock. 100 Pokey plus something else. Whereas these guys... <laughs> Did you know that this n new training gym, I think they called it a dojo, opened in town? You know how many rescue teams started up to deal with all the natural disasters? There was a group of concerned Pokemon. They wanted to support rescue teams. So they got together and built the dojo. You can find the dojo easily. From here, just head straight down. If you have a rescue team, I highly recommend pay the visit of Dojo. I see an ongoing trend of Pokemon. Yep, that's what Pokemon Fever is. Alakazam and his sidekicks were sure cool before. That's how a real hero has to carry himself. By the way, apparently it's been impossible for us to evolve lately. You know how we Pokemon evolve if the conditions are right? But for some reason, we haven't been able to evolve at all. It's rumored that the natural disasters are to blame, but... I wonder what's going on. Alakazam's team has the gold mine. Isn't that awesome? You have a rescue team too, don't you? What's your rank? Nothing special. I guess that's true. It might be rude to say it, but you obviously look like you really are nothing special. It just goes to show how awesome Alakazam's team is. You need to update your current games. That's true. I forgot. It was like for a moment. Oh yeah. I updated it a while ago, and now I don't. Hurry! No, I shall not. Sorry, Tiny Woods, I have too many missions. But I was, uh, let's go uh, pay a visit to Dojo. Ah, you! This is the Makuhu Makuhita Dojo. Through rigorous training, one begets true power. 
This dojo was founded to support the efforts of rescue teams. Train in different rooms to level up and toughen up your rescue team. Also, in the fire maze you will find only fire type Pokemon. In the water maze there will only be water type Pokemon. In such ways only one type of Pokemon will be given a room. Study how types match up in battle. The Pokemon in this dojo, by the way, are all volunteers. They are participating because they want to rescue teams to succeed. The only thanks they expect is to see you become stronger. Don't let them down, there's more. For a rescue team that successfully completes all training courses, I have a special reward. That Let that compel you to train harder. Hmm. I will go and uh, come back a later date. Hello there, welcome to Kangaskhan Storage. What do you want to store? Hmm, Peckaberry. Hmm. I'm not sure if the Gensing is permanent. Probably not, so I'm gonna actually put it away. And Orenberry, because I don't think we'll need all that much. Thank you very much, Kangaskhan. And now, let's go to the job list. Take job. Oh wait, we need that Peckaberry. Me dumb. I don't need that Peckaberry back. Forgot that we were keeping it for a mission. Pekka Pekka Peckaberry. Fine, I'll take your Peckaberry out of storage. Thank you very much, Kangaskhan. Any news? Nope. I think we already did that. Do I want to bring Ma Do we want to bring Terry along? friend areas. Whom should you like to visit? Terry! What moves does he know? Metal Sound, Tackle, and Thundershock. But he won't be that helpful at the one place, but we should keep uh, have him come along. Let's visit Terry! Neat! I don't think I ever really visited these places that much. It appears to be very happy. Join the team! Say farewell! That's mean. That's super mean. You could just be like, go away. But I thought we were friends. Thunder Wave Cave. And now we can really put the hurt on people. Ah, we'll run across that Poochiana later. We move as a unit to destroy. We use our units to kill. How dare you hurt me? I am... How dare you run away from me? We're crushing fools. No running. Running is for cowards. And you're not going to run away from your old friend, are you? I wonder if we'll have any recruits. Dang it. Yep, you killed them. And now, we'll just head to the exit. Up oh, uh, after we murder you. You get right back here. <laughs> you can try and run, but I will hunt you down and kill your family. The power of the <laughs> the rescue team is going to Neon's head. <laughs> Smack you. No running. How vile that they can run away so easily from me, but I can't run away easily from them. One of these days, the <laughs> one of these Pokemon will want to join my team, surely. Obviously not a Puchiana, because I don't have a... 
I don't think I have the place for Puchiana to want to join me. It's like they psychically know. He doesn't have a friend area for me. I can't join. Time to gang up on the poor, poor boy. Maybe you should have joined. Just annihilate them all. Gather up nice monies. If this were a game on, like, uh, a system that had achievements, I bet there would be a thing like complete eight jobs on one outing. That would be crazy. Quit smacking me for... Get back here! I'm going to murder you! Because you're not going to join the team. We have to beat you up. Get back here! You should have turned left. I would have left you alone. He's ganging on us. Well, that one's gonna get away. How dare you let them fiend get away! Rock. We don't let our victims get away. It's very rude. All my allies went the wrong way. We haven't reached a destination floor yet, so I don't need to worry about anything. Hopefully. Surprise! Your employer that wanted saving accidentally put the wrong floor number. They were too panicked. You're gonna die. <laughs> Get murdered, Nito Ran. Well, that's not good at all. No charging. This is a charge free zone. Put down your gun. You've reached a destination floor. I just need to get to my employers before the evil Pokemon do. Well, we got a Blast Seed. At least there's Beaver. Hello there, Voltorb. You are a foe who must die. You leave Metacham alone! No, Metatite. Here. Thank you. Why are you even in a dungeon waiting for someone to deliver you a frickin' berry? You make no sense. I'm gonna put myself in mortal peril so that someone can deliver me a fucking berry that can be found on the ground. I'm gonna beat you up. getting hungry. But I have so much more to murder. Hmm, can I check jobs? I cannot check jobs. We did find a bunch of apples, though, so I can eat without guilt. It's a cheat day, and apples aren't fattening. Unless it's a big apple. And we don't have those. Basement 5. I've reached a destination floor. You've reached a destination floor. Would you like to abandon your employer? Hello, Plussel. I don't have your place, so I'm not going to expect you to join us in my crime syndicate of God. There we go. It's like a puzzle game. <laughs> Get all of your party members free of status effects in the fewest moves possible. Yeah, that's a circle. It's a closed circuit. 
Wow, would you look at that, Metatite? If you just went up one floor, you could have gotten out, but you don't have a teleport badge, so I guess it makes sense. You're like in a dungeon and you're like, that, that's probably it. They don't actually want you to come into the perils of a dungeon just to deliver a berry. They probably went into the dungeon looking for a berry, and now they're like, well, can you come rescue me and give me a berry? Also 69, haha, <laughs> nice. I wanted to talk to my dude, but I... <laughs> Alright, and now uh, I think I can uh, do that. There we go. Tyrogue was found. You are rescued! Thank you! Please come see me at the Blipper office later. I would like to continue my journey, killing foes in the name of Pokey God Arceus. I'm getting his game sometime next week. This week? I don't know. Time's an illusion. That's it for this floor. On we go. I heal myself of a status condition, and then leave. Thank you for getting me the Orin Berry. Here's your award. Reviver Seed. And a Max Elixir. Hell yeah. Thank you for delivering the Pekka Berry. Here's your reward, the promised Gravel Rock. And a Reviver Seed. And five points. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward. More fucking gravel rock. Didn't we do good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. See you tomorrow. Have terrible nightmares. The rescue team members disperse to their friend areas. If you want to add members, to go do that, yeah. Your friends went home. If you want your friends again, you have to go call them. The next morning. Apples and water. Apple water. Apple soup. Good morning. Let's do good again today. Is this the place where the team named Shining is based? Oh, that was the wrongest name for you. Voice for you. There's nothing here. Depressing, isn't it? <laughs> Who'd run a rescue team from a dump like this? Unbelievable. Who are you people? Oh, over there, a mailbox. <laughs> yeah, check it out. Now wait a second. What do you think you're doing? Yes, rescue job offers. Ooh la la, isn't that rather tasty? We'll have them all. Stop. Those are meant for us. Don't butt in. <laughs> it doesn't matter who does it. We're a rescue team too, I'll have you know. But all we ever get up to is no good. Wanna know how it works? If we can have the cover of a rescue team, we can get away with so much more. We have our eyes on world domination. How are you gonna do that, idiots? What? World domination? You heard that right. That's why we're raking in the cash and adding to our gang. The world will be ours! The rescue team of evil! Team Meanies is who we are! Because that just strikes fear in the, into everybody. The team called Meanies. See you around! <laughs> no, wait a second! They took off. What an unbelievable bunch. Oh no, it is empty. They took everything. Well, not everything. Don't they know stealing mail is a federal crime? Well, we're in luck. Blipper delivered some mail. We can go on rescue missions again with this. We can also just go to the bulletin board. But those guys, they better not try anything if we see them again. We could have just beat them up. There's a warning tag on the side of the mailbox. Open the mailbox from the front. I can't get home. You will never go home. I will never allow it. Do, 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 do. 
Alrighty. I want to put away a bunch of stuff. Especially some spare dillies. But what's this? Uh, I can't look at that yet. Stored away. Let's see anything else. Bunch of apples and sleep seed. Boop. Let's see, what is a max elixir? A drink that completely restores the PPE of all the Pokemon's moves. Yeah. I don't think I'll need to worry about that for a bit. And the Peckaberry can go until we need a, mo uh, a mission for that. Wait, uh, we have 30 rocks, so we don't need that extra 10. We don't need 40 rocks. 40 rocks from the sun. We just need a nice amount. Anybody else have things to say? Did you know that a new training gym? Yeah, you already, uh, you already said that. Silence. Silence about sprout. You just tell me, let's go talk to Wish Cash. Yo. Oh, hey. Oh, Neon and Shane. Long time no see. I have a new friend. His name is Metapod. I'm going to call on Metapod and go play in the woods. It's going to be fun. Don't get eaten. Seeing the innocence of children that play is such a good thing. <laughs> when I was small, I was tiny. <laughs> well, I think that's assume. I think that is a what assume means, my friend. Well, let's see. Is there a, anything I can get for 1500 that I really care about? Gravel rocks, apples, stun seeds, and a max elixir. Let's see, what do you have? Frustration. Uh, escape orb, switcher orb, warp orb. Wait, do I have a... We do want a switcher orb. And see if there's any other mount steel stuff, so... No, just a tiny woods. All right, we will take out just a little bit of money. I would like to take out. Eh, just that amount. Because I'm gonna buy some, uh, a switcher orb and go to Mount Silver, which is a nightmare. <laughs> nightmare, nightmare, nightmare. I want a switcher orb. All right, job list. Can't get home. Pidgey wants help. Nidoran wants a switcher orb. Someone fainted. A ratata. My consciousness is slipping as I write this. All right, but with that, we're gonna have a lot of missions, but we're gonna have to go all the way up to the top of Mount Diddly D, so we're gonna want Three apples. Yeah, just three apples and we should be able to make it. I would like to take out an apple and we're gonna bring Magnemite with us. Three apples, just in case. Thank you, Mrs. Kangaskhan. Seriously, who names their team Team Meanies? Whom would you like to visit? Terry! Power! It looked pensive. Come along. Oh. Back home. I like that we can look at so many different places. We got a lot to do at Mount Steel today. Level one. There's nine floors to conquer and a lot of foes to kill. Out of the way! Well, that's very rude. Thank you for the sh cover, Shane. My, my simple move missed. My simple plan! There we go. Gotta play musical spaces. Whoop. 
Well, that works. And that's all the floors. Let's move on up. If we move fast enough, we won't have to waste uh, too much when it comes to our apple. Our apple stores. Well, we know the exit. For this floor, at least. How dare you hit me with your pitiful damage! Terry hasn't leveled up once yet. That's concerning. That's concerning. Quick attack him, Shane! Shane, I was counting on- SHANE! I got punched in the face twice because I thought you were gonna cover me! See? That's what it felt like. Getting punched in the face by an iron f fire. Well, your defense isn't gonna matter diddly. Cause you're now you're dead. You should have joined the team, but you don't have a place for me to live. That sounds like a you problem. Well, that's not good. Rock. Uh... <gasps> My rock failed me. But will it fail you? <laughs> Die. I wonder if we're gonna have to fight Skarmory again. Maybe I should have bought the diddly do lands so that Skarmory would want to join. Ah, destination floor already. That was a bloody. That was a bloody switch orb down here! Somebody's. I'm getting that fucking switch orb. I'm getting my money back. Switch orb! Well, I guess I can hold on to this when somebody else wants. Ah, a max elixir. Cool! Rock. And, uh, yeah. Even if you growled, it wouldn't do anything. Dare you. Well, that's very rude. There's a lot of enemies in here. That's not exactly what I wanted to do, but hey, it did decent. And just for that, you're going to die. Never mind, I'm the one who's going to die. Oh, I thought the Pidgey was an enemy. It's actually our, our, our client. Cherryberry Hills, pa ah, paralysis. You are now rescued. Fly away, Pidgey. You know, this is a mountain. You could have just done that. You could have flown away. I guess you could just be like, oh, I'm weak. Whoop. Now you're doomed. Double doomed because Shane just wanted you to die. Shane took one look at Zigzagoon and said, Perish. And <laughs> Trico doesn't even know that move. Perish Shong. Perish per Song. That's everything. We're just gonna go down to the log tunnel. Do not rapid spin, my dude. That's what it is. It isn't actually... That was scary, and I didn't even see what the move was. But all this time, I thought it was some kind of wind move. It's just rapid spin. I'm silly. Terry really hasn't leveled up all this time. We've gone on two missions to decent level uh, places. He's just not leveling up. Ah, uh, just in case. I forget if we heal our status effects. Oh, wait, I know. There we go. I'm terrible at that puzzle game. Not a destination floor, but we might get items. You know, like a frickin' switcher arm. I wonder if there's something in the game, like if you say, like, you're gonna do a switcher orb mission, if it gives you a switcher orb on the mission. Or if you literally can be like, Hello, do you have my item? Actually, no, we thought we were gonna find one on the way here and we just didn't. And then you don't get paid. <laughs> so many orange berries. 
You top spin the wrong Eevee, bastard. But yeah, note to self when fighting uh, boss monsters like Skarmory, just kill. Just do my super moves. Because I don't think the Blast Seed did anything. Getting hungry. Special defense fell. That doesn't help us much. But we're getting lots of rocks. Box of rocks. Weak things. Beat him up! Who needs strategy when you can just surround a fool and bash them to death? Uh, I'm just gonna kill you. Terry finally leveled up! Magnemite leveled up. You think you're funny? That makes me wonder. Why poor Pokey? But seriously. Oh, getting dizzy from hunger. We need to eat an apple. I forgot. Eat. But, uh, I wonder if there's gonna be Porygon in this world. I mean, I think Mewtwo exists. Get out of here, you ugly. Face smack. 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 Well, that's the worst thing to happen. Just imagine if Bide lets you survive with one HP. That would be a terrifying thing. No, nothing. Onwards to the exit. Never mind, there's a sleeping Geodude. Kill! Kill! It's a battle of the... Well, there's uh, dudes that are coming, so we're gonna throw rocks. We have a bunch of rocks. We might as well throw them. We just have a bunch of rocks. I'm gonna have to go get that back. Give me back my rock, fool! And I leveled up from that. You're not allowed to take my rock, it's my attack rock. It's the rock that I use to attack. Surround, surround and destroy. I did it, I leveled up. What is the concept of levels in this world? How does it function? Rock. Die. Hello. I said hello. You are now safe. Go home, rat. I will now continue my mission. There are many others. You are not one of them. Many others who require saving. Like these rocks. These rocks require saving. And if I use enough rocks, I'll be able to pick up all the rocks in the world. Ha! Huh. This is kind of a small dungeon level. Okay, I'll take it. Another destination floor. Rock. Die. Through the power of rock, I can kill you! Only nine moves. Somebody has stolen my blast seed. My blast seed. Die, Rock Man. This is mine. Rock. Die.
we will bash you to death with our faces. It is the scientificest of methods. You missed your takedown. How do you feel? That burning you feel? It is shame. We might just run out of space. Beat up on the Geo Dude! Beat him up! Nobody has. Ah! Baltoy! We have come to save you! Get out of here, you silly rock! We will continue the mission, because uh, we don't know if that's all of them. You may have used Meditate, but you will still die! You have done nothing. You have failed. Go home. And up to the next level. Reached a destination floor. I think... Hmm, have we gotten hunger? We have. Another apple shall be consumed. We've got to be in tip-top shape to kill. Quit jungling the monies. An orange gummy. Let me read upon the orange gummy. Info. Fighting type like it best. Well, we don't have any, so I'm gonna eat it. Yum. A lot of text went by. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. And now I'm gonna headbutt you. Kill! Anything that can raise its own attack, I scare it scares me. And uh, beat up the meta. Beat up the meta. We're gonna have enough orange berries to heal ourselves till Sunday. You are ugly, and now you die. Ah, Pidgey! We've come to rescue you! I shall not leave. The adventure continues! I believe that'll be everything. On to the next floor. There appears to be no one here. It is impossible to go any further. It's time to go back. Skarmory didn't want to fight. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward. 200 pokey. Thank you for getting me a switcher orb. Here's your reward. Reviva seed. Always valuable. And more gravel rocks. I'm going to have a billion gravel rocks. I'll never have to buy them. Thank you for rescuing me. Here's your reward. And gravel rocks. Here's your money. And bullets. Gravel rock. Went up in rank, from the normal to the bronze. Thank you for rescuing Pidgey. Here's your reward, Gravel Rock. Everyone just giving me my favorite thing, bullets. Didn't we do good today? Let's call it a night and get some rest. See you tomorrow. I would like to save my adventure. And I'm just gonna hoard frickin' <laughs> Frickin' Reviver Seeds. The next morning. I got my water. I got my apples. I got everything I need to survive. And a bumpin' bossy. Good morning. Let's do good again today. Neon Shane, huh? Who's that? Caterpie. Oh, Caterpie, how have you been? Please, please help my friend. What's the matter? I was playing with my friend Metapod. Ooh, foreshadowing was real. But Metapod got lost in the woods. He's still lost out there. Oh, I see, I see. That does sound bad. <laughs> hey, what do you think you're doing? Have no fear. We're here to save your chum Metapod. 
Hold on, Caterpie came for, to us for help. Yeah, you think you can do this rescue with your amateur level skills? What did you say? It doesn't matter who does the rescuing, see? The guy that does the rescuing gets to be the hero. Listen, Gatterby, how about we do this? How about you give the reward to the team that brings back your chum first? But I... I don't have any money. Oh, don't worry about that, my little friend. I'm sure we can persuade your parents to reward us with interest afterward. <laughs> oh, yeah! You can even join our team. There's an offer you can't refuse. When you join us, Caterpie, we'll let you be a big wheel in Team Meanies. <laughs> That's the deal, Shane. The first to rescue wins. Come on, move! Let's get this done already! Don't worry, we'll save your friend first. Neon, let's get going! Well, first I gotta check mail. There is no mail. Oh no. I have tons of rocks. I would like to sell some rocks. I have lots of rocks that I'm willing to sell. Let's see. You sell virus seeds for 800, but buy them for 150. You are a ripoff man. Honestly, I don't think selling's a, a good way for profits, dude. Escape orb, radar orb, blah, 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 orbs. I'm just gonna put a bunch of my stuff away. I'm just gonna gather up a bunch of things. Cherry, Oron, Oron, Switcher, Alive, Keep you, you, you. Blast Cherry, Reviver, Gravel Rock, Gravel Rock, Oron. And I'll take uh, two apples with me. Because we have to make sure that we uh, have a lot of food on the way. Because Team Meanies are going to be jerks. I wonder if I can headbutt Ghost Type in this game. I can only assume. Did you know that a new train? We've been over this! I thought you'd have something new to say because we've been extorted by Team Meanies! Shop! I've not seen Caterpie or other children lately. I wonder how they're keeping. Not seeing the children gives me a twinge of sadness. I know that you're just like an old, nice guy, but kind of creepy, that. Let's see. What areas do you have, my dude? Uh. Hmm. I'm going to go ahead and buy a few. Let's see. How much money do I have locked away? A decent amount. I'll take it all right now, so I can buy some areas so that, uh... Crap, I, I, I gave him to store, not to buy. I'm a fool. I got lots of money, and I want to buy some places cheap. Hmm. Basically, I think I'll buy a few of the lower ones. Bow planes? Gotcha! Let's do it! Wiggly tough, wiggly tough, let's be friends. You turn! Congratulations, you can go to the Bow Plains now. Hmm. I guess I'll go for the jungle because there's a lot of Pokemon I can get at the jungle to join me. No, thank you. That's a, a lot of things. I'll go ahead and store my money. Thank you. 
thank you, Persian. Guard my money well. Don't use it to fund any illegal activities. Hmm. Thunderwave cave jobs. They'll be nice to do, but we have to save Metapod. From Team Meanies and just saving him in general. Let's go grab a Terry. So Terry can help us. We're going to go save a Metapod child. All this real estate and we don't have any friends. To Sinister Woods! And this must be it. Metapod is lost somewhere in these woods. Gengar's gang should be in there already. We need to hurry. Sinister Woods! Ah, we got an apple right out the way. What are you doing here? I wouldn't think that you would be here. I thought you'd be like an ice type somewhere else. Sinister music for the Sinister Woods. The most terrifying of strings. Stringed instruments killed my family. I probably should throw rocks. How many floors does this place have? Come to think of it. Nice. We're just killing Swinubs left and right. There's not much to this freaky cavern. Uh, now we want to go up. Whoop. There we go. Getting the speed up to work is a little wonky. Luckily, it's just like, oh, you opened a thing. Okay. I'm, uh... Gonna go ahead and try and one-shot you. And I took damage for that. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. Now I'm gonna tail whip you. Bye bye! Idiot. I am the designated hero of this world, and you will respect me, or you'll end up like your darling, Pseudo Widow. More like Pseudo Widow, am I right? Uh. I think I'm gonna try another game option. Let's see. Dungeon? Yeah. I'm gonna do map and team up there. It's basically the same thing, and it cleans up this map a bit. Beat up the oddish! For being odd ish. You're gonna give that money back or I'm gonna kill you. Too bad. You die anyway. Quit taking my money! Wow, we're getting lots of experience from killing these Pokemon with moves. Huh. Not much here. The one downside to moving the map up is I kind of have to glance. You headbutted a magnet. Ha ha! You're silly! You headbutted a magnet again! Ha ha! How silly! You have a lot of health. Please die. You wanna join? Sure thing, dude! Ah. Well, you did sweet scent us, so. What should we call you? No, not. Delete. We shall call you... Sweetums. 
Join my team, sweetums. Power will be ours. Crap. He threw rocks at me. And now I'm gonna kill him. We must press onward. Whoop. Now we really are going to... Ah, oh, level up for Terry. Magnemite leveled up. Good job, Magnemite Terry. Now we really need to make use of our positioning skills. Ah, that's kind of odd. Kind of rude, actually. A corner is blocking me from moving forward. Don the random distribution. I'm gonna throw a rock at you. I'm gonna headbutt you. Yay. Good job, Shane. Uh, that was a very poor idea on the, your part, Oddish. I'll throw rocks to save you. I have plenty of rocks to save. Ah. Just an empty path? Nope. Whoop. I've been having rocks thrown at me. It hurts. Ever onward. How many moves do I still have? 16. Ooh, a gummy. I'm gonna guess a water type gummy. Info. Water type Pokemon like it best. Hmm. Hey, Shane. Eat that gummy. Oh. Wrong bloody no. Shane, I want... Uh, blah, blah, blah. I just want to feed him the gummy. Is that too much to ask? All right, now Shane, I need to go to items. I'm dumb. Use. It seemed to be somewhat satisfied. IQ went up slightly. Love the music in Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. It's not like the best example because it is kind of a sinister. Well, that just means a Pokemon entered. Beat up the Sudowoodo. He's now dead. Not big surprise. Ow. Alright then, you're gonna suffer for that. We're getting hungry, that's why we bought apples. Well, we didn't buy them, we found them. Ooh. Electric type? Uh, Terry might like this. If it is an electric type. Info. Electricity types might like it best. Uh. Give to Terry. Use. He learned a lot of things. Terry is a smart boy. And we got a blast seed. I don't really use seeds all that much. I don't really use a lot of things, really. Well, that's scary. I'm gonna throw rocks. I'm gonna throw rocks at all of you. I don't think it's really moving. I don't think we're gonna be taking Sweetums with us all that much. He's just wasting it. Bash it. Kill it. To the next floor. I'm waiting for the floor in which we disembowel. Team Meanies. 
Metal Claw, you learned a thing. The murder was grand. Limited vision. Not nice. I do like the way it kind of locks on, though. How dare you hurt me? I hurt you back! Beat him up! Beat him up! Hello, friend. You almost killed frickin' Sweetums. I think I should take your thing off. Sweetums, stop using <laughs> that, please. I think that should take it off, maybe. I don't know. It's been five billion years since I probably played this game. And I didn't really go all that deep into partner mechanics anyway. So, maybe that did something, maybe it didn't. Or maybe I just need to keep Oddish Sweetums right next to me at all times. So that it doesn't just stop at the end of a line. Rock. Rock! You're not escaping. Onwards we go. We could move on again. Beat him up. Beat him up. Beat him up. Maybe I should assign... Like, that's the one thing. I want to micromanage my my partners here. So uh, if I really want things to go as super great as I want, I have to turn on, go after enemies on them. Well, we're going after little normal dudes, so we don't have to worry too much. How much of a belly? Not that bad. Weather is clear. I'll throw a rock at you. Now you've entered the world of pain. You have made a terrible mistake in your life by entering this room. Where did you come from? Quit hardening! Get dying! Decay and become softer! Stop it! That's not going to help that much. Onwards we go! I don't know. Well, that's not good. We can't even see. That's extra not good. You look scary. Are you no longer paralyzed, my friend? I'm not sure how paralyzed works in this little world. Oh, leveled up makes me smile. That was a honestly a, a, a poor level up. You got so few stats, my dude. How dare you smack me? How much attack do I have? Eleven? Mm, I better save them for Team Meanies. They're doubtless to be a boss fight here. We should press on! Press our advantage!
but you still scare me. Clear gummy? What is a clear gummy? Information! Ice type might like this. We don't have any ice types on the roundabout. So I'm gonna go ahead and eat it myself. Because I am the icy wings. It doesn't seem to dislike this gummy. That's nice. If we had a water type, we could walk on the water tiles, I believe. Beat him up! Beat him up! Beat up the lanoon! Also, I'm... It's really nice that the experience distribution is to all Pokémon in the party. It would be so easy to be like old Pokémon. It's like, well, in the Pokémon games, that's how it works. Beat up the Wooper. Kill the Wooper. Take its soul. Sell it for money. Well, this place now matches frickin' Mount Silver. Blowback Orb. Beat him up. Beat him up. That's a beat him up. Beat. You have a lot of health. But I also have a lot of orange berries, so I'm gonna munch. I'm gonna adventure onwards just a little bit because there might be more items to be got. Oh, that's not good. Aha! Now you're trapped with nowhere to go. Now you've only trapped yourself in hell. Nope. Okay, good. It thinks it's gonna... Whoop! Quit tail whipping me! I am not interested in your seduction. Ah, Magnemite can fly over the water. Neat. A sizer. Scyther. And it only took two rocks. How dare you. Help! Recovered from paralysis. That doesn't happen in the actual games. On the Scyther. Beat him up. Whoop. Beat him up. You are not that evasion-y. Die. And I leveled up. So it all is worth it, even if my attack only went up by one. Pick up the radar orb. At least we can take these items with us. 
See, now that's good uh, experience distribution. Beat up the little sloth man. Beat up the child. The child is now dead. Come forth and face your fate. Onwards we march. Jesus Christ, this place is big. It's bigger than a mountain. How does a forest be bigger than a mountain? That makes no logical sense. No logical sense, you beans! We are low on power points. We were too frivolous with them. We took our power points, our PP, for granted. Now we need pills to restore it. You shut your mouth. It's like, oh yes, Daddy, hit me with it again. Waste your PP on me. And that is why nobody likes slack off in this universe. Please don't. I would rather not be focused. Well, let me guess, it's gonna be 13. A yellow gummy. That, nope. I want you to use it. Well, since we don't really have much in way of one thing, let's just move on. Yeah, of course, it's only 13. Wow, we came out quite a ways into this forest. I wonder if Metapod is ahead. Hold it right there! You know who's going to get to Metapod first? We are. So for you to go ahead. Well, we can't let that happen. What? Hey, Gengar, why do you always mess with us? Oh, didn't we tell you? I am his world domination. Caterpie's mama will give us a reward. Generous. And Caterpie will join us, too. That brings us closer to our goal. They're recruiting a literal child to their gang against the child's will. I don't think that they're going to match up against frickin' Alakazam. <laughs> and for that, your lot is in the way! So sorry to say, but your party's over right here now! Say goodbye, Shane. Rock. Well, that's not going to be good for my boy, but at least Metacham's gone. Now let's go ahead and beat up you. Well, we should probably walk ahead so that Oddish can get on this. But hey, at least we can beat up these assholes now. Well, that's not good at all. At least I have the Reviver Seed, so... I'm gonna beat you up. Everyone leveled up. <laughs> I wish. Terry is no longer cursed. Thundershock! And thank you, Terry. You single handedly beat up Gengar till he died. And that's why we need to bring teams in. Especially for story missions. Ow, 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 ow! You'll pay for this! Don't you forget it! I went Starscream there. 
No one should hold us back now. Let's find Metapod. Um, excuse me. Did you maybe come looking for me? You must be Metapod. Let us get you home. Caterpie was worried about you. Yay. I was scared, so I kept my shell hardened and waited and waited. Thank you. And we beat Team Mimi Mimi's while we were at it. This is great. Welcome back, Metapod. Thank you, Caterpie. And thank you, Shane and Neon. But I don't have any money. Oh, no, no. We don't need a reward. We're happy to see that Metapod is back safe and sound. Cool. You're even more cool than I thought. I want to go on rescues when I grow up. <laughs> well, that would be great. Chase that dream. I have an idea. Neon, we should do something with this place. We should make a proper rescue team base here. Something impressive. That's cool. A rescue team base is cool. I want to work here when I grow up. Me too. Me too. <laughs> That's what we'll do. Let's work hard and build our own rescue team base. Neon and Shane, thank you again. Okay, bye. Be careful going home. Ah, well, we ended up working for free. But that was the right thing to do. And we got to show Gengar's team a thing or two. So it's all good. And I mean, we got a bunch of items. IQ is very important. That was a tiring day. Let's do more good work tomorrow. See ya! The rescue team members dispersed to the areas. Would you like to see? Yes. Save completed. The next morning. Well, I think that's a decent place to end it. We've been going for a decent long time. Fear, fear. And we made uh, quite a bit of progress. And we can also save all story stuff for tomorrow. If there is story stuff, well, tomorrow, the next time I play. I meant more like tomorrow in game, but then tomorrow in game is today. Timelines. But yeah, I love Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. It's just so fun. I love doing the voices, all the music. I love the look of the game. Just look at that Eevee. The Eevee's cute. He's just amazing. But, da -da -da -da. thank you very much for watching. I've been Neon Ice Wings, and this has been Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Blue Rescue Team. Today, we woke up as an Eevee after I had to game the, the quiz for, f like, 15 minutes because it wasn't giving me the answers required to get Eevee in the first place. The world connived against me to make me not be able to get Eevee, and then it failed. <laughs> but then we woke up as Eevee. We found a friend in a Trico named Shane. And then we just went around and babe went, was a goody two shoes. Well, goody four shoes. Unless you count Shane having two feet, then it's more like a goody six shoes. But I digress. We saved a Caterpie. Then we saved a Diglett. Then we saved a Metapod. It was a lot of... Oh yeah, we also saved a Magnemite, who then joined our team. Well, we saved two Magnemites, and then one of the Magnemites joined our team. Hippie hey. But yeah. Tomorrow, or whatever's next. More than likely, I'll do Kingdom Hearts tomorrow. Try and finish up as much as that. And if I'm correct, we should be able to whittle down Kingdom Hearts Final Mix into two more streams. Maybe. More than likely, it'll be something like... Uh... Yeah, more than likely, I won't even do the Hades Cup on stream, but that's for things to worry about when I play Kingdom Hearts another time. But yeah, I had fun. Uh, hopefully my general design of showing this off works, uh, looks decent. <laughs> Not all that original, but hey, function. The overlay for this game. But again, thank you very much for watching. I've been Yannis Wings, and I hope to see you dudes next time. But I almost forgot the other part of the outro. If you want more from me, I have a YouTube channel, Neon Icy Wings, where I sometimes post edited content every, like, once every two years. 
For archives of these streams, you can check out Neon Icy Games on YouTube. And if you are one of those people watching these archived streams, then you can watch these watch me play these games live at twitch.tv Neon Icy Wings. If you want things like art from me, then you can hit me up on Twitter, DeviantArt, Tumblr, and uh, Newgrounds. Most of those are just Neon Icy Wings. The Tumblr is like Icy Wings Art Corner or something like that. <laughs> I, I don't even remember it. It just falls into an eternal cycle of me not knowing. But anyway, thank you very much for, for watching and I hope to see you next time. Bye-bye.